Are we all ready now? Are we done talking about putting snakes in people's rear ends? <laughs> let's let's make a start. All right. We've got a big old ship here, the Perseverance. We've made this. This is going to be the ship that carries us because it's got a big old shield and uh it's just an all-round like I think it's just basically a big support ship, so uh, it's it's pretty good. That's all. It's, uh, that's pretty much the plan here. I've gone for a very support kind of build, high uh, high EMP damage, some armor damage, a hull buster, and then a load of salamander missiles to back up with its massive shield and uh, pure sexiness. I don't know. Where's plan? <laughs> what? what? <laughs> Yeah, so I think the enemies can go inside the shield, but once the shield goes down, I then get a normal shield. It's like the usual auxiliary shields that the Star Federation get. It just it's just a big shield. It's the idea is it shields your whole fleet temporarily, I guess. I don't know. Uh we should probably make some more ships, by the way. We oh I forgot to mention as well, we are now at war with the hedge and the iron shell, so they'll probably be coming for us soon. Because we have kind of the most profitable planet. So we should probably build a little bit of a navy. So we'll get a couple of small carriers going. Um, and then we should probably we'll get one of those. Couple of invaders. Look at that. 175,000. It's almost like that was definitely not pre-planned at all. Aha! Fortress doctrine. Exactly. The idea is everyone will hide behind me. And everything will be okay. That's the plan. That's the only plan I have. Um, Empire-wise, things are going really well. We've got we've got Mining Planet 101 that's basically making us money, and the other ones are not. That's <laughs> that's that's all we've got going for us. <laughs> but we've got uh, both our heavy industries being upgraded as well, which will give us orbital works and then more more money well we'll see what happens with it i don't i don't know what's going to happen with our mega shield ship but we'll, we'll see <laughs> well I've, I've got that growing at the moment i've got a hazard pay and i've got hazard pay on it at the moment whilst it's still upgrading but my idea is to get that to at least level five and then yeah and then i'll stop going hazard pay and hazard pay it really sucks because from the last video i made with the cryo cryo, cryo revival facility thingamajiggy i missed like having 30 percent growth <laughs> it's, it's so upsetting not having planets grow in three months that was absolutely ridiculous that was good old captain dan <laughs> My oh boy <laughs> should have tried to take on the zig but it's fine it's okay uh we, we we live and learn mate genesis project and the cryo revival facility was just insane that was just like the best combination you could do my empire was just proper tasty It was it, it was pretty good. I was making a lot of money and I was kinda like, I need to end this video on a big bang, so I did. And again, Goosebub was strangely sad. <laughs> I mean I was trying to make it more of a meme ending. Um and then I just sort of did like the slowdown thing and I thought it was really funny, and then I thought it'd be even more funny to put some sad music over it, because then it would appear to be sad, but then also funny because Everyone sounds retarded in slow motion. That, that was my mindset on editing that video. So. <laughs> uh, I don't know what I was going to do with that, to be fair. We'll, we'll, we'll see. Um, get sick, Don, yeah. <laughs> All right. So that should be some more ships built for us. Uh, oh yeah, we've got. Give me all these. Mm. Oh yeah, <laughs> we've got our Buffalo Mark Four. 
just sat in storage. This is our emergency ship. If things start going horribly wrong, we'll we'll get this out. All right. This is this this is special. Uh, right. So, uh, I'll tell you what. Those two can go away. Well, this is a Star Federation only fleet. Uh, oh yeah, we kind of didn't want that ship because it kind of sucked. Um, okay. Well, I don't appreciate the uh, talent interceptors on... Is that really the best thing we can build here? I mean, we've got... What, what does auto suggest? I just want a standard kind of... Hmm, yeah. Okay, well, kind of... All right, nail fighters. These things have the... Yeah, they have little lasers. That works out for us. I don't know about ECCM package. Uh, considering we only have... Like, salamanders on it. I don't know. What's the other one got? Okay, this has gone for more of a bomber kind of thing. I say bomber, it has one cobra bomber. <laughs> we should probably just make that into two, right? There you go. We can have two Reapers on it. That's what I'm talking about. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. Talon Interceptor drones are only used for if you're going for like low tech spam of just good memes. I feel like these should have like some sort of long range support missiles. So if you have one Salamander. Right, bin that crap off. Two Nexus launches on it. That will keep people suppressed. And that is what we like. Can we follow the same here? Do we have any more Nexus launches? No. Okay, well, let's just throw on something. This one could just have... <laughs> this one could just have three Salamander missiles. <laughs> this is going to be the most annoying carrier in the game. We've got a lot of... We're going to go for lots of salamanders to keep people uh, just floating through space. And then our main ships can come out and kill things. I'm not sure if they're going to come out and kill things with this design, but... Jesus Christ. I like the idea of Reapers, but that's a bit ambitious. We should probably have something like Sabots on it, right? Uh, not using sparks. Um, yeah, but c Cobra Bombers, come on. And Nail bomb, nail Fighters. Nail, nail Fighters have little lasers on them. They're, they're pretty good. I think. Right, let's go. Let's just stick on some basic pulse lasers on this. Then we'll have a... Well, some anti-armor. Bin that off. Uh, I don't think we have any sour missiles. Okay, just some torpedoes then, I guess. That'll work. I'm not really too worried about these. I was following the, the old tradition of I don't really care about all my other ships, to be honest. That'll do. That works. This thing looks goddamn terrible. Uh... Well, I can highlight. <laughs> Congratulations. You find Jack Hammerbots. You'll shred anything. I think that's what they're called. Is that like... I think I know what you're on about. Uh, what's the funniest weapon you've found so far? Uh, definitely probably like the black hole generator has been great fun to use. You just summon a black hole and then just watch all the ships get slowly pulled into it and annihilated. That's probably like... the. The, the, the best, most fun weapon I've used. Um, but a close second. Actually, to be fair, maybe even more fun was the semi -brevs. They were They were ridiculous. Especially on that fast missile cruiser. That was, that was so much fun just running around and <laughs> just fucking people over with that. Uh, it's super weapon arsenal, I think. But I think that mod's gone now, isn't it? Because they were, like, ripping off assets or something. 
you have it on star sector that's silly plus goofy hmm uh right what am i looking for but yeah i it, it, it was good stuff super weapon mods but yeah it's it's like fully gone in it hey raw you fuck bucket is that a good thing or a bad thing <laughs> uh, okay right uh let's get this ship maxed out cool right there's a little fleet guy in there. I don't really know what to shove on this ship, to be honest. Just stick on standard, right? That's how we had it last time, and that kind of worked. So we're just going to roll with that design on it. Right, back over. Custom production. Let's produce ourselves some more Star Federation fleet. For actually, scrap that. We need to get a RAR class out. Just, you know, for, for good reason. We're going to need a bison for some storage. Um, let's get a couple of little frigates just so we have, uh, you know, some smaller ships. And we'll pick up one of those. Why not? Let's get that building. And now I can go back to interacting with you wonderful chat. How's everyone doing today? Has everyone had a very good... Uh, uh, day. This isn't a Star Fed playthrough. <laughs> it is a Star Federation playthrough. I just got to include my uh, amazing hammer, Ra class. Come on. Hey, Ra, fuck you. Ra is a fuckwit. Fuck off. Small time casual streamer. Fuck off, dude. Uh, yeah, good to see you guys are all doing well. <laughs> Fuck off, twat. Fuck you. Eat shit and die. <laughs> yeah, glad, glad you, uh... You guys... Glad you guys are doing well. <laughs> Look, we're building, alright? We're building our fleet right now. That's, that's what we gotta... We gotta build a fleet. Otherwise, we're just gonna run in and die like we did last stream, right? The internet has spoken... <laughs> literally get assaulted <laughs> oh my you know i was sat in um uh ambiguous amphibians twitch uh the other day uh just watching him play a bit of dwarf fortress and he was talking about um <laughs> how how nice his twitch chat is he's talking about how he doesn't swear in his videos and how much of a positive and kind twitch audience he has and i'm just sat there like i have the complete opposite <laughs> i have a load of people that come in here and shout abuse at me <laughs> supported by my moderators it's outrageous <laughs> yeah i've literally got the complete opposite oh uh, it's a good meme though right more ships more more dacker that's our uh supply ship expanded cargo holes on menu dry field i'm okay with that then we got these little guys which are basically little uh killing ships actually i could could i make them into laser ships no no they got ballistics i thought i thought that was more energy um Okay, let's go. Well, these are hybrid slots, aren't they? Oh, thank you. Oh, that's disgusting. Gremlin. Ah, <laughs> uh, oh, I suppose it'll be, it'll be rude if we didn't go safety overrides and then slap some fucking hammers on these bitches. You know what I'm saying? And then we'll put like a couple of these in. Actually, no, we want probably some anti anti shield and uh, some light jewel auto cannons. What's, how much do we need for expanded missile racks? Eight? Oh, yeah. 
I mean, we could probably put a chain gun on it, but that's way too much flux. So we'll just stick with the heavy mauler. All right. Uh, I was thinking that, yeah, the chain gun isn't going to, it's not going to work. It will, it will fuck the ship up too much, I think. But it, hmm. But it would also be a good meme. I don't, oh yeah, I only have one chain gun as well, so I, I can't go for it. Unless we just go heavy machine guns. <laughs> All right. Suck more than... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> eh? Um, heavy machine guns, they're, they're, they're all right. I wouldn't say they're anything like amazing, but they're all right. They, they do the job. They, they, they do indeed heavy and machine gun things. Uh, I have not tried the realistic combat mod. I've seen it. I keep looking at it and I go... Oh, that could be a good idea. And then I look, sort of look at it a bit more and I go, you know what? I struggle enough with this game. <laughs> I don't need anything, any other reason to struggle. Ra more like... <laughs> Turn on jazz? Absolutely not. You will not have jazz. You will only have the sweet sound of my beautiful voice. And you will enjoy it. Uh, right. Okay, we've a couple more ships being built. And then we should be ready to go out and beat up some nerds. And then everyone could be happy because they get to watch me kill some stuff. Oh, up to works are all done. And our mega port's been done. Does that turn my plan to actually being profitable? Uh, no, it loses even more money. Fantastic. That's that, that's exactly what I want to see. Exactly. Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> All right. Come on. Let's get this month sorted out. Get these, uh, get these ships in. Nah, I don't. I think it's... Wait, just wait until it goes up a level and it will start making some money. Well, that's exactly... Well, that's pretty much what I'm hoping for. I don't know what you guys are all about. <laughs> I am just amazing at this game. Come on. We all know it. Don't don't kid yourself. We all know that I am so fucking good. Uh right. Oh, hello. I accidentally out exited out the game now. Uh right. Okay. So why has it decided to throw safety overrides on this thing? Why does the game just insist I have safety overrides on everything at the moment? Uh, I really don't have that many weapons here. Fuck it. Let's just throw some harvest torpedoes on it. Uh, keep the point defense coming. Get some tactical lasers on it. I think tactical lasers. <laughs> Tactical laser is always a good choice, isn't it, Uneasy? You've never had uh, <coughs> we've never had a dis disagreement over tactical lasers at all. I know exactly why I want to shove on these, so I'm just going to sort of uh, keep the iron pulses on it. But I will grab some weapons for those soon. I've got an idea for them. Uh, fuck off. <laughs> 
Yeah, to be fair, Dakar is the way forward, all right? Putting Ra in charge of the planet instantly raises the hazard rate by 200%. Fucking outrageous. Right, let's head over to our Star Federation home world. Um, who's this clown? Oh, it's a convoy. I thought we were about to be attacked then. Uh, have I built megaports everywhere? I'm not really too worried about this place considering it produces <laughs> one. Volatile, that's fine. Um, all right, upgrade that to a mega port. Let's get that going. Right, let's head over to our Star Federation Brethren so we can actually make some better guns, shall we? Or buy some better guns off them. Don't mind me, I'm just eating some sausages. Hit more all points for pressing going button on your PC. Well, jokes on you. My power button doesn't glow because it's broken. So, <laughs> who's the real fucking winner here? Right. I'm looking for hole beams. Well, there's one. I want another hole beam, please. Hole beams on this ship are very tasty. That's all you need to know. Oh, literally, my PC is fucking shagged. Like, the case is terrible for it. Like, it has no sides. Half of it is like falling out. <laughs> the fucking, the, it's just, it's just a disgrace. All right, that's all you need to know. It doesn't, it's, it's a little bit broken. Hmm. We do not have another hole beam. That's very annoying. Uh. Fine. Okay. I'm not mad. I'm just disappointed. To be fair, I should probably put more missiles on it, considering it's got like a missile micro replicator, but... Ah. Who really cares about that? It, I'm not even kidding, right? It literally is. Everyone's complaining, like, you know... Oh, it's so... It's it, it's so cold in the house. It, it's terrible, you know. You can't afford to put the heating on. Yeah, nor can I. But I have a secret. I have a tip. Uh, you want to you want to keep the upstairs of your house warm? Start rendering a video. <laughs> I start rendering one of my vods, and suddenly the upstairs becomes nice and warm. <laughs> That's actually the real reason why I stream is so I can heat my house. Just by rendering the VODs. So today is going to be a uh, 16 hour stream. Just so I have 16 hours of footage to render. And that will keep the house warm tomorrow. Hmm. <laughs> Or some good sausages. Right. Most of us survive winters by hunting with PCs. Don't even think you're on our level. <laughs> Out Outrageous. Now, well, I enjoyed a nice <clears throat> bit of a toad in the hole, as it's called, or something like that. Um... <laughs> right what am i looking for okay it did not update the weapons okay whatever 
just stick a heavy pulse. We'll just put heavy pulses on it. I hate having different guns that don't or making the ships look uneven. It doesn't it just doesn't work for me. Um Do I have stabilized shields? Yes, we'll chuck stabilized shields on since we got a few extra points. And because we still have a few extra points, we'll take a little bit away from here. Actually. We'll stick a flux distribute. Oh, it's 90. Ah, oh, fuck it. We'll leave it. We'll do it. Happy days. Actually, wouldn't. No, no, fuck it. We'll leave it like that. Right. Now we have a fleet. And a, which is reason which is quite expensive at 6.1 jesus let's uh let's go and make some money shall we uh let's top up and fuel top ourselves up to a thousand supplies right who are we at war with then uh no one right <clears throat> okay warring is not going to be an option any pirate bounties? Okay, there's a couple of pirate stations down here in the south we can go and kill. Let's go do that. That's always a good test of a fleet. Uh, we'll also take a tactical save here. Just, you know, just in case. Everyone loves a little tactical save. I wonder if I... You know what I really fancy? I really fancy a bit of ice cream, actually. Hang on. Hang on. Let's get let's get down let's get down south to the to the uh, pirates. I'm gonna see if I my wonderful partner will bring me up some ice cream. Hey, can you bring me up some ice cream, please? No. Thank you. You're the best. Yeah. Sound. Bye. All right. Ice cream is secured. <laughs> Let's go kill some pirates now. Uh, you can just run Minecraft. That was fine. Hey, Rob, can you take a quick break so I can get a drink? Thanks, Rob. Rob. Uh. Don't worry, there's two pirate bases I'm going to kill. So I'll kill this one while she'll get a drink. And then you can come in and watch the second reckoning of the pirates. I hope you stub your toe on the table. <laughs> Ooh. Oh my god. Oh my god. Hello. Fancy seeing you lying around. I mean, it would, be, it would be rude if I didn't take this. Let's just, just snatch that up. All right. Uh, easy day. Cheated. <laughs> I mean, it will be rude if I didn't if I didn't take that, right? What, what a brilliant start that is. All right, let's go bully some of these pirates as well. Spawn. <laughs> Even I'm amazed by that one. I was not... God, this, this stream of luck that I have is actually, like, outrageous. Like, generally, my, my my luck that I have in this game is just unreal. Also, I love how, like, I've got the big ship here and just no one is staying near me. Come on, I have big, I have big shield. Look, they're inside my shield and there's nothing they can do. Haha! <laughs> okay, I, I, as you can see, the shield does get smaller and smaller and smaller. Like, as they do more damage, the shield does, you know, get smaller. But, then I, once my shield, once this shield's down, I think I get access to another shield. Or I hope I do. Look, he's inside me. Like, inside my shield, that is. <laughs> He can't, he can't shoot me. <laughs> He's inside my shield. That's what I meant. <laughs> there you go. Look at that. And look at that flux generation. Nothing. The only big flux is when I shoot my big old hole buster cannon. 
which one hits little ships. No, you're not allowed to quote. That, that's illegal. That, that's illegal. We, we've already established that. We established that years ago on this stream that you're not allowed to quote me. All right. Dead pirates. Uh, I just realized I forgot to bring some heavy machinery, so... They're not going to be able to rely on salvaging to keep us <laughs> supplied up. Um, what we're going to have to... Re Let's see if there's anything around here. Oh, yeah. No, it's really... We Let's, let's just go and break down all of the pirate stuff. Because we can. Are you serious? AI inspection? For oh, fuck's sake. Oh, there's remnants here. Hey, why are they going for me? Kill the pirates. What the fuck? <laughs> hey, come on, man. Why? Why have you got to fight me? Why can't you go and fight the pirates? For fuck's sake. All right, fine. Right, carriers, you stay with me. Everyone else, go do your own thing. Just let me get ahead. Right, we want to probably, like, shoot that big ship there, right? Come on. Hull buster. Oh, big shot. Big shot. Happy days. Right, let's, uh... Let's just start picking out the little ships, shall we? My cobras are missing. They're re what? 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 Excuse me? Hello? Can someone please confirm? Reaper right there on the screen. It bounced. It fucking bounced. Can, can someone... That's... That's bullshit. Uh, I reckon the scrapyard armories. To be fair, I was looking at that today, actually. But, um... Yeah, I, I, I'm still putting the mod list together for my next video. So I might, I might have to add it. Uh, oh boy, I've wasted more than three years of my pocket money on a... F this fair freight streamer. Yeah, I love you too. You have it. Uh, but no, I do appreciate the 37 months. That's uh, fucking ridiculous. But I do appreciate it. Your money is going on a good... Will be going to good use. Remember that today... Uh, remember that your, your money does go to good use. Because uh, it's, it's Chinese takeaway day tomorrow, baby. <laughs> so... <laughs> All donations from this stream will be going towards the cost of a uh, 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 Chinese tomorrow. <laughs> oh, that's real friendly fighter. No, my invader. I'm coming. Get inside me. Ah, there you go. He's protected inside my shield. Turns out wasn't protected from me though. <laughs> he might have been protected from the enemy, but he wasn't protected from me. <laughs> okay. All right. <clears throat> uh, I mean, well, I guess we'll recover our ship from a slight accident. Uh, it was nothing more than an accident. All right. There's no no liability there. Uh, that's that, that's going. Oh, that's a 50-50 on the insurance claim. <laughs> oh fuck's sake! All right. <laughs> All right. Let's kill. Let's uh. Let's kill this station, shall we? Right. Boys, gather around me and my big shield. You will be protected. Okay, that shield is disappearing very quickly. Oh my god, the shield's gone. No, it's not. It's still there. Right, let's get rid of the hangar bays first because I want the old air superiority. Go, Cobras! 
Come on, Cobras, get over there. Come on. Where are you going? Go. Hit the station. Come on. What are you doing? What the fuck are you doing? What? What were those Cobras doing? Why did it not go for the... <sighs> okay, not to worry. We killed it anyway. All right, let's back up a little bit. Back it up. You remember when I always say I don't trust the AI? That was pretty much like the main reason why. Pay for that stream of luck card. <laughs> pretty much. The game's bullying me. Right. Mr. Invader, please do not fly in front of me. I am trying to... There we go. Yeah, that's a reaper on the station. All right, big shields down. To be fair, we should probably have this main bit of the station. No, maybe we won't. No, we're probably going to flux out in a minute. Let's back it up. Play it safe. Play it safe. Let's wait for the auxiliary shield to come up. And then we're uh, going it for round two. There we go. We'll do a quick flux. Get everyone inside the shield. There we go. Ugh. Story points are great. They make any ship viable. <laughs> any ship viable after you stick about three S mods in it to make it somewhat a functioning ship. All right. Get rid of the station. All right. And we should be able to... Okay. Fight's over. Easy clap. These bloody Cobra bombers, mate. They're not worth it. Uh, <laughs> whoever's flying those is getting the sack. All right. One pirate station down. We should probably fly home. and Because we're going to have to fight off the hedge AI inspection. So I don't want to waste a story point bribing them. And it's also, But it is also a good time to get our brand new ship that we recovered up and running. Uh, give me makeshift equipment, please. <laughs> That's at least going to reduce our cost a little bit. That's pretty much the plan, is to kill them and then drag the Star Federation into a war against the Hedge again. That's, <laughs> that's the plan, everybody. And then we'll go and kill the Hedge. And who's going to stop us after the hedge is dead? Probably the ninth battle group again. Or myself. There's that floating piece of shit station that's killed me a couple of times. Um, you know, I might have to put a complaint in because this ice cream is not rocked up yet. I, have to, I think I'm going to have to put a complaint forward. This service is... <laughs> <laughs> it's, it's lacking. Ah, <laughs> oh, right. Uh. Well, look, I need to get some money together, all right? Actually, it's probably a good time to start building some more ships. Uh, we'll go for this big old thing shall we what does this do uh it's got fighter bays in it that's good enough for me i'm kind of going for like almost not carrier spam but it is kind of carrier spam i guess i want ships that all have uh at least a set of fighters in them so then we can rule the skies and uh, everyone can hide in, hide inside my big shield and everything will be fine. That's kind, of, that's kind of my doctrine I'm going for here. 
spam and shields. <laughs> Uh, right. Let's get over to the production world, which is... Oh, it's not production world, is it? It's mining world 101 that's about to be raided. Which I am going to upgrade the orbital station to a battle station, I think. Because if that's the only place that ever really gets attacked, because, well, it's the moneymaker, isn't it? So... That is, of course, going to be the place that gets attacked the most. Uh, it's probably a good idea to build more orbital stations on our other planets as well. Uh, mining world. That's already got one. Oh, I'm not too worried about the gas giant, to be fair. How do people use wolf pack tactics? Uh, sabots, hammers, and reapers. <laughs> and numbers. <laughs> That's how, that's how, that's how, that's how you do it. Alright. Uh, so I have a, yeah, I have a commodity forge here, but I do, do I have any more VPC chips? Um, oh, I have loads of them. Holy shit. Right, that's that. Give me five of these, three of these. So this is like my big brain play when I do uh, forges. I just keep one of every chip and the rest go into a mega forge or a commodity forge and uh, it's happy days. All right, we'll strip this bitch down, chuck her in storage for the time being. Uh, that's going to produce us a shit ton of supplies, which is going to be nice. It's what we like to see. Um. Yeah, cool. Right. Let's just wait for the next month because then that will be another load of production. Oh, wow. It's actually gone straight for more Cobra Bombers. You know what? I'm all for it. I'm all for Cobra Bomber spam. Let's do it. That means we currently have five sets of Cobra Bombers between all of my <laughs> all of my fighters. So I deploy with my allies. And we just go against something like, I don't know. That. Actually, maybe not that ship. That ship bounces missiles. That won't be a good example. I don't think a single ship is going to be ready for uh, the Cobra Bomber spam. <laughs> yeah! Go get them, boys. This is a fantastic idea. Yeah, to be fair, I haven't actually like adjusted anything. I will probably... Hyper velocity drivers are probably so much better, but I don't think I only have one, I think. So we'll just leave the twin rails on it for the time being. Um Oh, this ship is actually might bin that off. Uh actually too fair, this has recovery shells built in, so I should probably have something a bit more sensible on this. Like, maybe something that actually uses crew, considering it's got <laughs> The recovery shells built in. But I don't really have any other fighters. I don't really have many fighters, actually. Unless we just go for the fighter drones with the rail guns. But that's AI as well. Hmm. Or we go for a whole load of hammer bombers. I know that's still not what I'm going for here. Hang on a minute. What do you guys think about having nine hammer bombers? You know what I'm saying? Because <laughs> this ship has all the Nexus launches, which will keep him fucked up. And then it will launch a load of hammers. Look at that. It's a beautiful idea. Okay, maybe... <laughs> Maybe it's not. 
<laughs> it's a spam of hammers. <laughs> Look at them go. <laughs> You can't tell me that that's not terrifying. Right? Right? Yeah. Maybe they'll get it eventually. Go on. No! <laughs> okay, it, it, it's shit. You suck as well, but fire them fast. <laughs> it does not matter. Outrageous. Yeah, they don't work. Okay, let's just... Let's just play it sensible. Let's get some. Let's just go for some. Uh, some of those fires with a railgun. Some intercept the drones. And. Ah, fuck it. We'll go two sets of intercept the drones. Why not? This is more of our. This can play more of a support role. Whilst it also has. Uh, expanded missile racks on it. And if we've got we've got a CCM package, where are you? There you are. There we go. So this thing can just throw out a ton of missiles. Got a nice. Fuck's sake! Let me do that again, so we can have a ton of missiles so throw out. <laughs> And throw out enough fighters and you, you know what I'm on about. Just 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 go with it, alright? Uh right. Okay, so yeah, yeah, yeah. ECCM package. We probably want expanded deck crews just to get things moving a bit faster. Weapon groups, shove all of those on a single weapon group on linked. So that means now when it goes to fight a ship. Let's just throw something in. I don't know. Let's just throw the usual hammer in. It can now launch four Nixus launchers at something and they will have no shields. Almost no shields. There you go. And then the drones will do whatever the drones do. This is a heavy anti-shield thing. Look at that. Okay, I think it's probably a little bit too heavy on the anti-shield. Considering I'm going to be fighting the hedge, it's probably not a good idea, actually. Scrap those. Replace those with maulers. Uh. Uh. I really don't have, like, anything, do I? Tough. Right. Uh. Oh, we could go for... Piranha bombers. Fuck it. <laughs> That'll do. <sighs> we'll roll with that. Going to the law, needing projectiles are only a few nanometers wide. Hmm. Um. Cool. Right. Now we just wait for the hedge to come and kill us. That's the plan. Uh, support role. Instantly means the ship is going to get caught out of position during combat and die. Yeah. Yeah, that's usually what my support ships are doing. They're supporting me by dying for me. By taking the bullets so, uh, I can win. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's, that's, that's the strategy I go for, right? Uh, okay, so the AI inspection will be here in six days. We'll hide behind the station and kill the fleet. Like so. Or we'll die trying, cry, and we'll end the stream early. That's also a viable option. Look at that though, very few demods in my fleet. That makes a very big change to normal. Usually my fleets are just filled with bang average ships that just die. Oh Jesus, that's actually quite a big fleet. Oh, oh no. Oh no. <laughs> it is actually 
that's actually quite a big inspection fleet. Uh oh. Okay. I'm not nervous. Not nervous at all. Because the big ship is coming to save the day. Here we go. I can put the station inside my shield. So, in theory, it should be safe because the station will be inside me. <laughs> oh my god, the station's getting fucked up. I'm coming, I'm coming! <laughs> there we go, it's protected! Oh, I need to stop burning. That'd probably be a good idea. Sweet Jesus, that's a lot of DACA though. Right. Okay, we need to probably just get rid of the smaller, easier ships to kill, right? Oh my god. Right, that thing's dead. Oh god, those onslaughts are probably doing so much fucking damage. Alright, we're going for the onslaught. It's right in front of us. We kind of have to hit this thing. Come on! The support ship is not doing support ship things. I'll just shoot this thing since it seems to be getting... Oh, God. This... No! <laughs> the station! <laughs> Hang in there, station. Come on. <laughs> oh, shit. Well, at least we're pushing one onslaught off. Oh, my God. What is this thing? I should have got that battle station built up sooner. I should have just bribed them. It would have been much easier. Oh, fuck's sake. Right. Okay, we're losing the station. More of the story. The station is going down. Repeat, the station is down. Right, call in the rest of the reinforcements. We need, we need, we need bodies over here, folks. Come on, get some shots on it. Old Buster, you shot the wrong ship. All right. Okay. Oh, good shot there from me on that kite. Oh. <laughs> oh my god. Onslaughts are coming. The Dakar is coming. Right, we need to kill these Moras. We need we need if we're gonna win, we need air superiority. That's what we need. Right, invader, just go and kill that bloody thing, please. Oh, God. One of the onslaughts are coming. <laughs> I really don't know what to do here. Rip another one of Rod's fleets. My air over yet. There's one thing going for us. The onslaughts are damaged. They're damaged goods. To be fair. Oh man, there's just... There's three, so you've got three ships up there. That onslaught there is probably the best bet we've got of taking one of them out, right? And if he's coming... Okay. I thought he was going for a... I thought he was going to get very eager there. Right. Fuck it. Everyone... Get on that onslaught. Get him. He's out of position. Get him. Get him. Come on. I know it's not, not means nothing, but we will be over. We should hopefully get him overloaded. Oh, Reaper on the side on him. Oh, the Cobra Bomb is coming through. Come on. <laughs> Keep the pressure on him. 
We're actually... <laughs> actually slowly killing this thing. Oh, the whole buster. Oh, we lost one ship though. Right. That's fine. Bring in more air superiority. Come on, we can, if we can get one of these onslaughts. Okay, I should, okay, let's not get too out. That's too risky here. Fuck. Fuck. I overloaded myself. Shit. But it's fine. Our auxiliary shield is up. Oh, no, 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 no. Cancel that order. Oh, that invader's so dead. That invader just risk, risked it all. <laughs> Right, you guys stick on me. That was... I don't know why the invader decided to do that. That was not a good move. Although it did allow me to bring in my other actual fairly decent ship. Come on! Oh! The aggressor's on a flame out. It's all calculated exactly i know exactly what i'm doing i'm a professional at what i do oh thank you oh fuck no 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 <laughs> you weren't meant to die you stupid ship Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. Surrounded by fucking idiots. Right. Come on. That thing's venting. Come on. Both the onslaughts are incredibly damaged at this point. Come on. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. My ship is very fragile. I can't afford to let a bloody aggressor just snipe me like that. Oh my god. Okay, right. You three, go and deal with that. Go deal with that fucking Mora behind us. Right, let's shoot this thing whilst we're slowly retreating. I mean, we're not retreating, we're uh, repositioning. Go Cobras! Oh, the Cobras are actually paying off for us! It's not a retreat, it's a tactical reposition. Although that carrier is about to get itself killed sitting in front of me like that fuck's sake <laughs> ow <laughs> ow god damn these bloody that god damn dacker The hell was this thing okay it looks like the onslaughts are actually retreated though that's good have you played dwarf fortress yet yes i've played a bit of dwarf fortress the game just makes me very very confused right let's just consume whatever this is Oh, for fuck's sake. What even, what even is that thing? It's got like... I don't... I don't even know what it's meant to be doing. It's a weapons arm? Oh, dear. Oh, there's so many ships. <laughs> right, 
Right, we need to get rid of this thing. We have to get rid of it. If, if we're ever going to win this, this aggressor needs to die. Holy fuck. Come on. Oh, my own ship's getting in the way now. Oh, we're starting to get swarmed by him. Oh, no. The raw class. <laughs> my boy. <laughs> my boy. <laughs> Oh, come on. Right. That Mora that's been flanking us is dead. Jesus Christ, this battle's been... I thought when it said an inspection fleet, I thought it was going to be something tiny. Not this bullshit. <laughs> Here we go. Oh, my shield's about to run out, but at least it's doing its best to keep my other my allies alive. <laughs> Mate, this whole buster is definitely MVP. The whole buster is doing God's work to keep us in this game. Right, you two, kill that thing. I'll keep them busy. Okay, okay, yeah, don't, okay, if it's retreating, just get, get back on me. Get back over on me. Uh, right. Got a hammer coming in. Is the hammer gonna die? It's like the ship just needs one more big gun on it. If it had, like, one more large slot, I reckon the ship would be incredible. It just needs that, like, one extra bit of DACA, doesn't it? To kill things. We're doing an excellent job of keeping all of their crap away from us. Yeah, I, it, it's, it, it's a good ship. Don't get me wrong, but, I, yeah, 60 deployment cost. But then again, it does add, like, 5%... Uh, it has like 5% nav beacon and a 5% thing that increases weapon range or decreases their weapon range. So it's got that built in as well. So it's it is, it is mainly a support ship. It's not <laughs> this uh, OP killing machine. It's mostly just to give the rest of your ships a nice boost and a good shield. Oh, mate. Get rid of all these fucking little things. Goddamn rats trying to nibble away at my shield. Right, that's got to be it, right? We just need to pick off as many of these as possible bef before they all retreat. Right. Let's kill this weapon arm. And then that should be it. The bloody hell is this... Is this thing gonna die? Hmm. Yeah, <laughs> Star Federation pretty balanced. Yes, fair and balanced. Just just keep shooting it. We, it seems to be working. We're slowly killing parts of it. It's an angry fidget spinner. I mean, it's got loads of guns on it, but it's just not shooting. I don't know if it's, like, broken or something.
There we go. Holy crap. Now that was a fight. Tell you what I need to do quick though. Uh, repair ship. I need to change out those salamander missiles. They're not doing me any favors. Let's just shove on these missiles. They'll do the trick. Uh... Right, stick them on free. Right. Cool. Right. Uh. Join the battle. We'll kill the rest of these losers. Not the UAF with literal nukes. <laughs> yeah. Nuclear bombs. A little bit overpowered, I won't lie. Go, missiles! Zap! Right. Finish up these stupid ships, and then we've still got the goddamn uh, big ships to fight. Uh, those broken ass uh, things. Uh, onslaughts. That's what I'm trying to say. Nice. Right. Let's get back to the station. Dump all of this. Dump that. Dump this. Well, <sighs> here we go. Here's the big fight. The fight that matters. <laughs> They, uh, they don't want to negotiate. Probably should have just paid the 20,000 credit fine. Or uh, bribe, sorry. Hmm. Have a mouthful of ice cream and let's do this. Get some sugar in the system. Alright, boys. Best bet. Probably just, just stay with me. That's probably our best bet. I'm hoping these ships should still be, like, broken as shit. Oh, I have gone past the fucking beacon. <laughs> oh, fuck it. It's, it's all tactical. It's all tactical, of course. We're actually just going straight for the rush tactic. Come on. We need to get rid of as many of these little ships as possible so where we can just play with the big boys. Right, let's kill that phase ship straight away. Just get rid of that fucking thing. Lucky little bastard. Uh okay. Just keep slowly drifting over towards this thing. Sorry, ship. It doesn't really matter, all right? We can't call in any other ships, so. <laughs> oh, Jesus Christ. I'm missing all my shots now. Okay, carrier has been caught out. That's one of their ships dead. Oh, fuck. Okay, our carrier is dead not good well at least a lot of their ships are dead hell yeah right that little thing here needs to go this courageous needs to go because this is going to cause me problems otherwise nice right whack her back round all right let's get rid of the weaker uh, sniper variant bloody aggressor here. To be fair, that onslaught is completely shagged, actually. Annoyingly, I think they actually do have more range than me. Mm. 
Right, come on. Come on. Ow. My logic is, if we can get him quite close to fluxed out, we just spam a load of missiles at him and pray that that works. There we are. Go, missiles. Go. Ow. Oh, God. He has so much point defense. Oh, he has two Devastator cannons. Now, that'll do it. Oh my god. Oh, hello, hello. Hello. He might have one of them here. Alright, that's one dead. Here we go. Right, let's get a little bit over towards this. Ow, 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 ow. Okay, that was a really bad idea. That was a really stupid idea. That was a really, really stupid idea on my behalf. But it might actually work out for us. Because the auxiliary shield's here. Oh, here we go. Ow! Ship, go and kill that. We gotta get rid of one of them, please. Come on, you've got to kill that aggressor. It's so weak. Come on! It's all right. We should be able to get this onslaught at least. Go missile spam. Go fight. Okay. That's fine. All right. Let's pick off the... Uh, let's get this bloody aggressor out of the fight. There it is. There we go. Fight's over. Oh. Alright, I won't lie. That was a lot harder than I thought that was going to be. But, we're the winners. <laughs> Get fucked. He actually fucking did it. You're damn right I did. It only... What did it cost? Basically our entire navy. Mm. What can I say, ladies and gentlemen? Uh, Star Federation ships are fantastic. Right. Okay, with that big epic battle out of the way... Get some, uh, we, we need to build some more ships. <laughs> Pyrrhic victory, game of Pyrrhic victories. That is true. To be fair, you get the, you get the occasional decisive victory <laughs> where you lose like one frigate and murder like 40 ships. And you're like, wow, that was, that was a good day. <laughs> Yeah, I think it's just because of all the um, all the debris. It should clear up any minute. It'll sort itself out. It's all the debris going around in the state in this star. Actually, maybe if I uh, just slap this on performance mode, there we are. It's a bit better. But yeah, what do you reckon? Uh, what do you guys reckon we should build now? Ship wise. As much as I don't think the carrier spam worked, I think we need some more carriers. <laughs> you can never go wrong with some more carriers. Build the Genesis project. Uh, I haven't unfortunately lo unlocked it yet. True. I should, yeah, maybe an actual raw class. That's probably not a bad idea. Uh, let's get one of them going then. Obviously, we're going to go for the fancy pink one because the fancy pink hammerhead's cool. Build some mod skippers. Oh, mate, don't you worry. I'm once I'm already ahead of you on that one. Uh, if I just head back to the 
back over here, we've got the Mud Skipper Mark II or Hellborn Frigate. This is uh, this ship is for the uh, real chads. The this is this is the Mud Skipper Mark II variant. As you can see, this is a Mud Skipper with a large gun on it. <laughs> <laughs> Need I say more? What, just so you could have a mud skip with a high with like a bloody lance on it? <laughs> could you imagine? <laughs> right, I don't know why these things have decided to go for a Cobra bomber on a logistics ship. It seems one thing is to have uh is to be is just logistical so you can have high resolution sensors uh it doesn't really have a lot of cargo hold does it no only 200 so it can just have efficiency overhaul on it Whoa, there we go just have some stupid drones or something i don't care the ship is not a combat ship right there we go. Your one role is just to sit there and be more salvage for me. What is that god awful thing? <laughs> Do I get 20? <laughs> I don't know. The thing is, you don't have to worry about the flux too much because you don't have a shield. So, you don't really need to worry about it. You know, you, you start fluxing out, you just slowly retreat back. To be fair, can we actually, if we stick like integrated targeting unit on it, here we go, here we go. Well, I'm just, what's a terrible, terrible ship that I can fight? An Atlas. Oh yeah. <laughs> here we go. The little mud skipper Mark II versus an Atlas. Alright, well, it looks like we got to play the game of outmaneuvering it. Uh. Quick vent. Fuck! My gun broke! <laughs> no! <laughs> Just you wait, buddy. Just you wait until my gun comes back online. Just you wait. <laughs> Just you wait. If I actually get like inside his shield. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Oh fuck. Okay, no, that didn't work. <laughs> all right, yeah, it's a brilliant ship. That's all you need to know. That's all you need to know. It's the best ship in the game. What was your plan there? To get inside his shield. I don't know if you could do that, but it was my strategy. <laughs> what, like a Reaper launcher, like a medium one where you can have like four Reapers on it? That would be, uh, that would be amazing. Right. Ice cream has been consumed. Sugar levels are high. Let's go fucking kill some things. Well, I say kill some things more. Let's uh, <laughs> keep rebuilding our military. Um, I mean, we could just grab a union. Unions are like pretty good. Let's grab a union. Why not? Don't wish for it is the best. Yeah, yeah. I can't argue that. They're pretty good. Not for me though. I, I'm I I suck at commanding them. I am so goddamn awful. All right, at least our star base is going to be up soon. Um, try not dying as hard. What do you mean dying as hard? We won that fight. We fought off the big old hegemony inspection fleet, and there was absolutely nothing they could do about it. They got absolutely rinsed. 
Can we keep an AV from blowing off the stream? Come on, guys. Why have you... Uh, why, come on, you can at least say something nice. Come on. I, I believe in you guys. You can say one nice comment about this stream. <laughs> Please, I beg you. Whilst uneasy, he's not here. <laughs> oh, fuck, he is still here. <laughs> oh, bad. <laughs> All right. <laughs> God. <laughs> He sat there lurking in the shadows, ready to attack anyone. All uh, right. Uh, I don't even know who that is. To be fair, shall... Let's just get out of this system for a second and then we'll come back and hopefully that should fix the old frame rate. If not, I'll have to do a quick restart and no one wants that. Oh, bloody Nora. I think this is going to require a little restart because it is a little bit shagged right now. All right, let's do that. Let's do a quick restart. All right, let's take a save. I'll tell you what, actually. Let me... Let me uh, let's, let's, let's do one thing quick. Let me show you... Uh, let me show you the Captain Dan thing. Uh, let me go back to my last save. Oh, Jesus Christ. Maybe I should restart the game first. Ah. Check this out, check this out, check this out. I'll show you the amount of planets that I had. I definitely should have restarted the game first. <laughs> <laughs> That might have been, might have been a sensible idea, but it's going to be worth it. A current fleet doesn't even register as a navy. I mean, what would you register as? <laughs> it's a navy. Aha, here we go. Oh God, yeah. Haha! -ha! This was beautiful. Okay, they're all losing money at the moment because they're all on hazard pay. But I was slowly, I was going to go do a big meme where I was going to build like a revival facility on all of them. Um, unfortunately, uh, I decided to try and kill the Zig and get myself killed. But th this is uh, this is what I was going for. Every planet was getting about eleven or twelve percent growth. <laughs> I still think like Dan Shack got a, uh, um, it was up to like uh, level six in the cycle two hundred and eight or something like that. It's pretty ridiculous. Anyway, this this is like lagging like shit, so I'm just gonna restart the game. Okay. Come on, uh, Star Sector, don't embarrass me now. You're meant to be uh gotta 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 go fast and, and pretend that I have a really good computer. thinking about it come on <laughs> you just have a lot yeah 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 thousands thousands of mods at this point you know what i'm saying i can't play star sector unless i have 20,000 mods enabled at once all right there we go we are back in business let's just slap the old Streamlabs back into performance mode. Uh, let's also close down Chrome's probably a big one. Oh, look at that. Shut down Chrome and 
Suddenly, everything's much smoother. Ah, right. How far away are we from a... Okay, so that's going to take 87 days to build. I'm pretty sure we uh, we ended up with at peace with the hedge again, didn't we? Uh, yes. We aren't actually at war with the hedge anymore, so I think... Oh, there's a... Oh, ship flying around there. We'll take that. We'll just chill out. <laughs> Usually run 50 to 100 mods. I'm going to go grab something to eat while he's <laughs> like, Jesus. Yeah, okay, I don't really... I think I have, like, 15 mods. I think that's about it. I don't really have that many. Oh, look at that. 870 supplies thrown into my uh, storage. That's pretty good. Fucking idiot every time. Come on. Yeah, no, I'm not going to do that. I, 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 like, I like frames. I love the chaos of all the mods. See, I do want to try... Uh, one of the ideas I have in my big old video idea list is just to download as many faction mods as possible and see what happens. Yeah. <laughs> just try and download every faction mod <laughs> and see how quickly the game just derails into chaos. I, I was thinking about doing it on like a... Um, what was it? Uh, Derelict Empire. And then just seeing who wins but that's a video that will take an incredibly long time to uh, record and do so it's it's in it's on the back burner at the moment uh oh yeah we can build another industry on production world production world is level four uh i can make money if we don't give it hazard pay aha uh do we i don't think we actually make any organics do we I think we just have loads of... No, we don't. So if we just... Add refining here. Because mining's not really worth it, but refining... Here we go. We're going to start making a little bit of money. 20 gigs of RAM, Jesus. Yeah. I don't know. We'll see what happens. Uh, right. Did it actually... Have I actually built any more ships? No. Ah, there's the raw class. There we go. Let's bring her back. Get rid of all that crap. Boom. Let's, let's, for old times sake, safety overrides. Hopefully it doesn't die this time. Two chain guns. Some goddamn cheeky hammers. And two Vulcan cannons. Happy day. Oh, and a flux distributor. There we go. Happy days. Everyone's happy. Can't go wrong with the raw class. Best ship in the game. Uh, how many raw? Only, only the one. Well, kind of two. But actually, the second one wasn't actually a raw class. It was just a hammerhead. But this is the second official raw class. So it's not going to die. It won't die. The raw classes never die. It's actually just an illusion when they do die. Uh, let's actually... Whilst we got like union building, let's actually make some weapons. Because I don't really have many... Well, actually, that's a good point. I don't actually have many weapons I can make. Well. That's not good. Uh, let's make, we can make some beams, though. We'll make five beams. Can I actually make tactical lasers? Because I feel like tactical lasers are the most difficult thing to find in this goddamn... Yes, I can. Tactical lasers are like the most difficult thing to find when you're trying to fucking build a, you know, a ship with lasers on it. Every time I go to Tritec, they're just there like, nah, sorry, mate, out of stock. And I spend half the bloody game just trying to find tactical lasers. Because the game doesn't want you to. 
Yes, it does appear to be that way sometimes. The hell's this? Pirate raiders in my system? I don't think so, buddy. I actually get paid paid for that as well. Look at all my little star-fed mining operation fleets. We have so many patrol HQs everywhere. We will keep my system safe. <laughs> just assign all the RAM to it. Every single piece of RAM you can, just assign it. All right, happy days. Does that mean my sh union's been built? There we go. The union is here. This thing is a beaut of a ship. Uh, if you have the right stuff for it, which I don't think I do. Uh, oh wow, we could have like one of the little, uh, we could have the little one of the little drone launchers in the center of it. Everyone loves the drone launchers, and if you don't like the drone launchers, let me let me show you why you sh you should love them. Check this out, right? You're probably thinking, oh, what the hell is this piece of crap? What's, what's he banging on about? And then they're just like, boom. Look, it shoots a little ship out. Look at it. <laughs> it's so cute. See, aren't you in love with it? Don't you love it already? I don't know. Can you shoot more than one at a time? Oh, look at that. Ho <laughs> ho Don't you love that? Uh, unfortunately, though, they're pretty shit, so, uh. Um, yeah. LTA mod. So, there you go. Uh, but no, we won't be using that. Um. <laughs> Not to, you know, put it down, but we won't be using it. Uh, right. We'll turn this ship into a good old beam boy. That's what this ship's going to be used for. Lasers, lasers, lasers. Oh. That won't. These have all been changed. I... Don't remember. They all used to be small energy slots, if I remember. They weren't ballistic. No! How dare they change things? That's not... <laughs> they're not meant to do that. Fuck. Oh, this ship just became useless. That's right. Long range point defense on our back. We got beams. I want a lance, but I don't have a lance there. Uh, they're not hybrid. I swear they used to be hybrid. Fuck's sake. I'm at the hardest part of the game, deciding a faction name. Yeah, that is... That's pretty brutal. Oh, I don't know what to do now. This ship, the ship's ruined. Fuck it, you can go back in storage. You're shit. Fuck this. Let's go out and do something. We sat around talking bollocks for too, for too long. Let's go kill some things. Um, when I say kill some things, let's go. I don't think we're actually at war with anyone, so uh, there's only one place to go. It's down here and kill the mess. I think. Let's go kill the mess. Oh, and I, I did that last. I think I did that last stream. Maybe we won't go kill the mess. What should we go kill? Uh, or try to kill. We go around here. I don't think we surveyed anywhere around down like in the southern bit down here. Hmm. Already a fire base. Hmm. <laughs> Maybe. There's a warning beacon high up there, but I think I've been up there. 
There's a medium one down there, which I don't think I've been to. So let's go down there. Let's go die in a medium warning beacon area, shall we? That sounds like a very sensible thing to go and do. Nope. I don't pay taxes. I'm part of the Star Federation. We'd rather go to war than pay taxes. Uh. <sighs> it's what I do in real life. To be fair, HMRC comes knocking on the door and I just throw potatoes at them. I'm like, fuck off. I ain't paying taxes. And then, yeah, if I stop streaming, you know what's happened. They've sent me, <laughs> sent me to jail for tax fraud. <laughs> Sounds like a Tory to me, giving back to the community, no? What, taxes? Have you not seen what the new thing they're bringing out on the taxes? Uh, 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 the new expense that the MPs can now take. They can now take uh, Christmas, or they can now have uh, Christmas expenses nowadays. So, like, basically, not only is, like, everything... Uh, everything they ever want to do in life is paid for. Their Christmas is now paid for. It's such bullshit, isn't it? <laughs> All right, remnants. Come here, you little shit. Come and fight me. Let's do let's, let's do some big boy fights. Yes, raw number one streamer, best best streamer on Twitch. Don't don't forget it. Number one streamer on Twitch. <laughs> you can't silence people who want to compliment me, or I'll silence you. I I am authority here now. The rules have changed now, buddy. I demand compliments. Don't make me do it, Uneasy. Don't make me do it. Hey, guys, see? <laughs> the people demand it. The right to express their opinions once again. Biggest streamer on Twitch right in zone moderator. Oh yeah, we've already Oh yeah, we we uh oh, we did that, didn't we? <laughs> last time we uh last time I timed out on easy it fucking <laughs> banned him from the stream and he couldn't get me well he wouldn't let you be moderator again. Uh, Mr. Nice Guy, thanks for the Prime for 12 months. A whole year of being subscribed to me. Don't you feel treasured? Don't you have like a warm, fuzzy fit? Danny Rolani's. Okay, that needs to stop. <laughs> Alright, let's not take this too far. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Right. English civil rule. <laughs> yeah, we all know the south will win. We all know the south of England's better than the north. It's not really much to prove there. Uh, I got a crimson world there. Not really. Unfortunately, nothing amazing. Can we have a research station, please? Calling for a research station. Hello? There is no research station around the star, unfortunately. Um, to be fair, these planets have been fully surveyed, so I've definitely been here before. 
Hmm. Oh, well. Let's move on, then. Oh. Saturation... Saturation bombardment. Saturation? Saturation bombardment? Saturation bombardment. What's going on? Aha! Here we go. Here's another... Here's another system we can explore. Hello. Oh. Oh my god. Okay. Well, this ship, they do have a radiant here. With four lances, is that? Or three lances? I don't know. We'll be alright. Just gotta go together as a little unit. Everything will be fine. Ra class, you're on your own over there. We'll go right. To be fair, that is the one part about being, uh, the one thing that is bad about being, uh, living in the south is it does mean we are closest, you know, closer to the French. But then again, at least we're not closer to the Scottish, so it's kind of a, it's kind of a catch twenty two. <laughs> All right, let's head up north, try and find their fleet. All right, let's get rid of this brilliant class. That would be a uh, a brilliant idea. Ah, <laughs> ah, oh. oh. comedic genius, I know. Uh, right, throw loads of missiles at it. Dead. Right, you, you're next. Now that was fun. <laughs> Alright, Radiant is in the center, so we should probably go and uh, try and have a little hustle with that before it murders everything. Uh, yeah, you, your, your, your job is to kill that. Oh. Right, here we go. Hello, buddy. Please do not kill my, uh, my ships, please. Try and kill... Stop trying to kill my ships. If I engulf him in my shield, he can't shoot my friends. That's my strategy here. Oh, man, this Radiant hasn't even got a chance, has he? Radiant, more like fucking garbage. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> oh, yeah. Sorry, I thought you were meant to be a dangerous ship. Ain't nothing on the Star Federation. What a pile of garbage. Ooh, okay. Hello. Go missiles. Right. You should be able to beat that raw class all by yourself. Alright, maybe not actually. It was a bigger ship than I thought that was. I thought that was one of the, like, anti-fighter things. More fair and balanced mod. It's, no, it's not the mod, it's, it's it's the captain, you know what I'm saying? I think, I think it's just because there's such a good, you know, po like, such a good captain at the helm, you know what I'm saying? I think that's the problem here. It's not, it's not the mod that needs nothing, I think it's the player. <laughs> Can I sound smug enough? <laughs> All right, let's just sort of float around for a minute and sort of recover. Okay, so there's actually a damaged nexus here. Uh, which we could probably take out. And a lifeless world. Hmm. All right, I really want to fight all of that at once. I'm not going to lie. I think that's a few too many ships to fight. I feel oh God, there's no like asteroid fields or anywhere I can lose them in. All right, let's go. Let's kill this little fleet then. We'll, we'll slowly try and kill them all one by one. That's probably our best bet here. I love how I pretty much just have three carriers and two ships that can actually do something. Carrier spam. 
It's the best strategy. Backed up with artillery. Da -da -da. Yeah, they're really not having a they're not having a good time here, thankfully. That is uh That is these guys killed. Cool. Right. Give me more of that good stuff. Thank you very much. Happy days. Right, let's try and uh lose these clowns. There's something there. I wonder if that is Oh <gasps> there's a research station here. That is exactly what I wanted to see. All right. Let's drag these uh, idiots out here. Go dark. Give them the old slip. You know what I'm saying? Oh. See you later, losers. Goodbye. Oh, fuck. Uh. All right. Now that one is alone. Let's get him. Ambush. Alright, now we should be able to just pick them all off one by one here. I don't know. The Cobras, they aren't quite cutting it, are they? But I refuse to get rid of them. Because that one time they do actually do something. They're amazing. You know what? I think my ship got a little bit too eager in that fight. Uh-oh. Time to focus here. Uh, uh. Alright, get rid of the little ships first. It's always a good strategy. There we go. We got we got big shield out now. Yeah, who's fucking laughing now, huh? Who's laughing now? <laughs> Oh, really? I missed that? You have a load of missiles, you little shit. Hey, you want some more? There's some more. Hey, uh, this little guy wants some too. You're in my shield space now, buddy. When you ruin you... <laughs> when you come in my shield space, don't expect any mercy. That should do the trick, right? Oh, he's still alive. Oh. Oh, he's overloaded, though. Come on. More missiles. Jesus Christ. Right. Quick vent whilst uh, they can't shoot me. <laughs> God, this, this, this Perseverance ship was a very, very good idea. All right, that's one of their fleets dead. Well, two gamma cores out of that. Uh, and a level up. Very nice. Viva la revolution. <laughs> French language detected. <laughs> you must go. <laughs> uh, oh, hang on a minute. Let's see if we can... So these are considered ballistic weapons, right? Um... Uh, screw it. Let's grab Ballistic Mastery. Makes our Dacker a little bit better. It's really revolutionized. It's time to get the chopping board out. Is that what you're trying to say? Now, we could probably take those two fleets on ourselves, but why make our lives harder for ourselves, so... Let's drag them out. Do the old go dark. Oh, nope. They still have vision on me. Ooh. 
All right, fuck them. I'm going, I'm going for the research station. Fuck these guys. They'll be too far away, hopefully, and they won't be able to stop me. Hello, research station. Oh, come on. Is that it? Really? You could do so much better than that. And the double dip didn't even get anything. That's, uh... Well, that's depressing. Alright, a little survey here. Well, there's actually extensive ruins. And some fungus. Oh. Uh, <laughs> uh, let's send the Percy League. Uh, really? There's like nothing here as well. Ah, oh, what is this disgusting find? Right, let's get out of this system now. There's nothing in here. Pile of shit. Waste of time. Wasn't even worth it. I wanted so much more. But got so little. Oh. Oh. Oh, fuck's sake. Hey, look at that. Refining's now uh, being built a uh, production world, and production world is actually making some money now. Which is good. It's actually profitable. All my plants are now profitable for a change, so, uh, yeah, go, go me. Uh, looks like uh, Mining Planet 101 is going to be leveled up soon, which is good. It basically means it's going to make us millions. Uh, yeah, we should probably start investing in mining world 102 so that's gonna start costing us a bit of money but hopefully get that planet growing and i don't really care too much about oh screw it we might as well do that as well here screw it our plants are no longer profitable <laughs> yeah i know i'm just slacking all right I'm riding off the high of that battle earlier and I think I can get away with little things, but turns out I can't emergency I can't just, you know, not emergency burn out of that slipstream. Oh. Would you look at that? An acid world. Let's survey it for the sake of it. Could you imagine how terrible it would be to live on an acidic world? I couldn't think of anything worse. Actually, there's probably a... Knowing the galaxy, there's probably like a hell of a lot worse planets out there. Isn't there one which is like... Isn't there one that like literally rains metal sideways or something stupid like that? Uh huh. <laughs> I remember there was just this really old video I watched of like most extreme planets and there was something like that. All right, there's a black hole here. <laughs> Is this insert some country? Oh! Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, uh, I want to get that research station, but I don't want to get too close to that black hole. Um. Uh... Alright, let's go for it. Go for it. Fuck it. <laughs> okay. Not bad. Project Silk. Not not bad. Uh, you remember that? It shoots out lightning. Very cool. Uh, okay. Not terrible. Not terrible stuff. Some experimental blueprints here and there. All right, we're good. We're good. Don't worry. Oh, fuck. It's not what we wanted to do. Just slowly roam around. Tell you what, though. I've, I've already said, like, uh... 
if like uh, we ever discover like a black hole uh I'm, i and if i've got like some sort of horrible horrible illness uh I'll, I'll be willing to for science to like jump inside it or something like that <laughs> you know what i'm saying i i I'll do like uh I already said, like, I'm, I'm ready to do, like, something for science if it comes to it. If I've got, like, some sort of horrible illness and it's going to kill me in, like, you know, a year's time, I'll do something stupid for science. Like, what happens if you flew into the sun? Yeah, we'll see what happens. <laughs> what happens if I get stuck in a black hole? Yeah, let's go. Let's do that. Let's, let's do something. Colonize Mars? I don't think I'll make it to Mars. I think you'd probably die. But, uh, time is warped horribly around black holes. They might not ever even see you enter, just floating next to it for decades. I have no Chinese food. Worse than toxic world. <laughs> Sick rains. Uh, alright, there's a high warning beacon system here, so let's take a save. But yeah, I'll, I'll, I'd volunteer to jump in a black hole. Why not? We'll see it. Just do it, do it for the meme. See what happens. You know what? I don't even need to be. I don't even need to be like terminally ill. I'll do it. If they ever start asking for volunteers, I'll sign my name up. Then at least I'll be in the history books of like man jumped into black hole. <laughs> or actually, it'll be like number one Twitch streamer. Uh, dies from jumping inside black hole. Actually, no. The, the title that everyone would, or the news article that everyone would want to see is uh, "Man jumps, uh, number one Twitch streamer jumps in black hole, still manages the stream." <laughs> what was a huntress? Uh, do it for the meme. Exactly that. Uh, what the hell's a? Oh god, missile station. Uh, we should probably start moving because that thing is probably going to shoot at me in a minute. <laughs> we better fucking move. <laughs> Holy shit. Number one black hole jumper. Still bullied by his chat. <laughs> uh, well, that's the remnant next to this. Is there, like, actually anything, like, generally here? Uh, I think it's industrial evolution that adds the missile stuff. Comms relay, what's that? I don't think... Oh, fuck's sake. Star's too big to get near it. There's too much going on here. There's a watchtower here. Yeah, I don't really want to fight that fleet. Oh, here we go. This is what we're looking for. Fortunately, we can't actually uh, survey it because of this guy over here. Yeah, let's give him the slip. <laughs> Sucker. Uh, <laughs> it's still my favorite thing to do in this game. <laughs> All right. Oh, stop it. This is what I want to see. Thank you very much. Uh, we've got a planet here with vast ruins. Okay, this better be like some good shit on it. I thought that was two pristine nanoforges then. It's stellar reflector course. God damn it. <laughs> I almost like fully shat my pants then. Out of joy. Uh, Alright, there's a fleet there chasing me. God, these watchtowers are just... Oh, yeah, we need to get out of here. We need to get out of here. I think it's time to leave. Oh, fuck me. Oh, no. No. Oh. 
This is exactly why I will never download DIY. <laughs> yeah, that's understandable. Jesus, that was close. Uh, shots fired. You are now hostile between the iron shell. Well, shots are being fired. Don't we have an expedition coming on our planet, actually? We should probably... Oh, fuck. Um... Okay, Mining Planet 101 should be able to handle that. Yo, I'm just gonna upgrade this to a goddamn Star Fortress. Oh, yeah, you know, no messing around here. Mining Planet 101 just gets raided all the goddamn time. Right now, I'm gonna Twitch. <laughs> Yes. Number one streamer shits himself on stream. Wow, that's a lot of alpha AI cores. I think it's time we left. And we left very fast. And we need to actually generally do need to get home before our plants get blown up. Which they probably won't, but you know, safety first. Uh, run away. We'll have to use, we'll use the uh, storms to give us a little bit of uh, acceleration towards our home. We're going to have a ton of supplies at home, so I don't need to worry about that. For fuck's sake, leave me alone. This fucking station all the time almost cucks me with bullshit like this. You fucks. All the time, that station... Ah! I hate it. I absolutely hate it. You f all right, let's kill these stupid fucking pirates. It's fine. I'm not angry. I'm not angry, all right? <laughs> no. We should be we should be able to handle a load of uh we should be able to handle a load of pirates, so It'll be fine. Everything's going to be okay. Everyone just will defend this comm station. We'll let the pirates come to us. We hide behind my shield and we hit them with our carriers. Yeah, but I want to get home because we're being attacked. I don't really want to fight stupid pirates. No, to be fair, usually I get caught by the station normally. Thankfully, I managed to actually avoid the station and not get caught by that. Otherwise, that would have been GG because that's a goddamn star fortress. There we go. Oh, look at that Buffalo Mark II just getting mauled. That's a beautiful sight. Right, stick together, boys. Let the pirates come at us one at one, one by one. We have something called the big shield, and they don't. Be fair, let's get rid of their carriers. Let's get rid of their Colossus Mark Twos. With those dead, at least they won't have any little. F <laughs> at least they won't have a spam of talent intercept to fight us. <laughs> and we'll kill their fucking donkey as well. There we go. I think mean, that's all their carriers dead. Besides from the little mining drones they have, we should be able to... That should be all of their fighters killed. Oh. Oh, another carrier. A shepherd. That must go. Well, they do have some blockheads, and blockheads are pretty terrifying ships. I think we can all agree that there's nothing more terrifying than a fleet of blockheads coming towards you. Not only do they destroy your ship, they salvage it up afterwards. <laughs> I 
All right, pirate's dead. Oh, should we recover the Buffalo Mark II? That is the real question here. Hell yeah. Yeah. You know, it is definitely the best ship in the game. Even with all those D mods, I don't think the AI will be able to handle it. Maybe the mall. No. No, it's not. It's not. It's not the Buffalo Mark II. See, that was actually a trick question because I was always going to recover the Mark II. <laughs> yeah, exactly. It's not quite the Mark IV, but it's pretty darn close. <laughs> All right, let's get rid of this little bit of some metal, so we're not holding that around. D-Mod just makes it better. It's like throwing a pile of metal trash at someone. <laughs> exactly. They won't know what to expect. They'll see this really high-tech Star Federation fleet backed up by Buffalo Mark IIs. They'll be so confused. They won't know what to do. They'll be... Th the sheer panic it will cause them. They... It's 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 immeasurable, immeasurable, immeasurable. It's it's a psychological warfare. That's that's what we're going for here. I don't know. I'm just kind of making things up and expecting one of you to come up with something that's like sensible and actually funny. So <laughs> this is on you guys. Um. Right. I do hope we've beaten this Ludic part, uh, Ludic Church expedition here. Uh, they are currently in system, so hopefully we can just sort of dolphin dive straight onto our planet. I appreciate the honesty. <laughs> That's all I've got. Uh, uh, okay, there it is. Get it, boys. Get it. Join the battle. Let's get in there. With the let's get in there with the uh, big boy ship. As per usual, we will just fly over to our station and con. Wait, where is the station? Is this not a battle with? The okay, it's not a battle with the station. Oh, this is they're retreating. That's what they're doing. Oh, okay. Cool, I guess. Well, this isn't a very good expedition if they just arrived and are instantly retreating from the planet. Go, missiles! All right, there we go. That's enough killing, I think. I think we sent them a message of never come back, you stupid church. Uh, right. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Uh, get 10 buffaloes. Here you go. <laughs> you got to run. Okay, when I said someone's going to come up with something funny. Uh, <laughs> uh, okay. Obviously, because we're following down the doctrine of uh, fighters, we'll make, we'll convert in hangar, right? Also, an antimatter blaster is very ambitious. So, yeah, that looks good to me. Carrier Buffalo Mark II with the Talon Interceptors. I ain't, I ain't gonna stand a chance. Uh, too fair. Can I spend the money to upgrade my ship? Oh, that's the run simulation button. Can we restore it? We can. We're gonna restore it. And let's actually build in some stuff into it now. Obviously, the bunk bulkheads or bunkheads. That's uh, definitely what it's called. Uh. What else should we build in? Because we don't need to build in heavy armor. 
We don't need operation centers. We don't need expanded missile racks. We don't need surveying equipment. I guess just building an integrated targeting unit probably wouldn't be a bad idea, right? Considering it's like pretty much... Because I don't need anything else, to be fair. Or I could go... Because this ship already has a fleet op center, which gives me 5% ECM and 5PN nav rating. So I could probably go for a nav relay. And then that'll give me 10% speed on all of my ships. Which probably wouldn't even be a bad thing. But I also feel like just building an integrated targeting unit because it's forever going to be... Yeah, I'm just going to build in. Fuck it. I'm doing it. I don't need your permission. I will do it. And then everyone will judge me in five minutes time. Uh, what I am also going to do is do a shield conversion, actually. Because one, that makes my shields cheaper. And two, I only ever really use it facing forwards, so. Yeah, I know how you guys operate. Five minutes when I... Let's give, give it five minutes as soon as I think I'm safe in the clear. And then it'll be like, oh my god, Ra, I can't believe you've done that. That was such a bad idea. <laughs> is the kinetic driver better than the gauss cannon that is the question i'm gonna say no we're keeping the whole buster because the whole buster is incredible we could go for the project silk but i feel like i need an actual weapon that will do damage to the shield i mean as fun as the lightning is it doesn't really do that much damage. And it also seems to be zapping my own units, so... <laughs> Probably not a good idea to bring in uh, out an unpredictable weapon that can damage your own units. Yeah, no, it's, yeah. Or I could just build in a Storm Needler, but I don't think it's really got enough range. That's the whole buster. Yeah, it's not really... It's not going to cut it. Plus, it's pretty shit. Yeah, fuck that. Right, give me the, give me the uh, remnant gauss cannon back. That's what I want to see. I'm also going to put the accelerator on three. It's just so missiles are on two. So that means we have a shield arc of 360 degrees at a cost of 120. I mean, our flux dissipation to weapon flux is still slightly out. But... To be fair, I could probably just get rid of these machine guns, to be honest. I don't think we really need them. Because we already have point defense here. Fuck it, I'm getting rid of these side machine guns. I don't think we need them, because we have so much point defense already with the flat cannons. Actually, no, let's, let's, let's play it safe. Let's play it safe. Let's leave one machine gun on each side. There you go. And then at least it leaves us with 10 extra points just to whack in... It lowers our flux dissipation, uh, weapon flux slightly, and just gives us some more capacity. There you go. Uh, does Fern have a... Uh, I don't know. No. What? No. I don't know. It has it has big fleet shield thing. Don't worry. Uh, too far. I probably might replace these with... Nah, it's fine. We're fine. Uh, right. Okay. We have, like, 500 heavy machinery here. So, let's from <laughs> We've got so many fucking supplies here. So many supplies, heavy machinery. We've got so much of everything. We've got so much good shit down here as well. We need to find a planet which I can build these experimental forge templates on. We have the uh, Duminator and a lot of other cool ones which we need to build. I also have some ship blueprints that I need to still enable. Um. Okay. Alright. We're good. Need me to build more of the... Uh, Oh, the crystals, whatever they're called. Um, uh, where are they? 
There you go. We'll get some more of them going. They're pretty good. Uh, well, I think we do definitely have enough carriers, to be fair. We just need to reorganize that. Yeah, these things are pretty beasty, to be fair. They do a hell of a lot of damage. Uh, this thing, they're pretty much, like, carrying my fleet whilst I do dumb shit. We also have an illegal arms dealer here. Oh my god, he's selling not only the Paragon, but the low-tech Paragon. Oh! Nah, there's only a maximum order value of 282,000. This man's selling everything. Holy shit. Look how many blueprints this man actually has. Holy crap. This man's got everything you've ever wanted. You want whatever the hell this is? Um... <laughs> oh, that's a good ship. The Battle of the Infernos. Um, oh my god. You want a bear? You want the heavy mining platform? Yeah, I'll look at the weapons in a second. Oh my god, this man literally has... <gasps> oh my god, he's got... I've never seen one of these. I've been trying so long to find a ship. Does anyone know what this ship is? Prometheus Mark IV. Does anyone know what this ship actually does? Because this, for those that do, it's a beautiful thing. This is an IED that shoots IEDs. <laughs> it shoots IEDs. <laughs> oh my god, he's got the doom in it. This guy has everything. I suppose this is a good way to look at, like, all the mods that I have enabled. Oh my god. Mad. Absolutely mad. Alright, this so I'm guessing... Oh my, he's like every weapon as well! And fighters. Does he have spooky wings? Ah, oh, he doesn't have spooky wings. He has heavy bombers. Oh my good god. I really hope this guy stays as a contact. So he can construct up to a million. Right, I need to make some money fast. I need to sell some stuff. I, <laughs> I need to sell some stuff very quickly and get a million. Um, We'll be back. Don't you worry, sir. Let's shift all this... Uh, crap that I got lying around. Relic components, they can go. Uh, just, just grab a ton of stuff. Is there anything I want to sell down here? Not really, I should probably save all this stuff. Now uh, we got spare, uh, spare blueprints can go. We'll sell one of these stellar cores. And then we'll just buy a stock up on a load more of these, a uh, load of heavy machinery we can sell. Right. Uh, where's the nearest place? Right, let's just go over to our friends in the star fed. <laughs> go, go, go. I swear to God, if it revamps on this day, I'm going to be so upset if all the bar jobs change. I want to buy a big amount of weapons. It'll be his loss if he moves bar. I think they change monthly. They better not. If it does, it will be a sad day. It doesn't matter though. It's, it's more his loss than it will be mine. That's what I'm going to keep telling myself. Right. Okay, we should probably go sell this on an independent planet, to be fair. Rather than, you know, fucking up my allies. Hey, Mr. Independence. Uh, I'm not getting the best prices for these, but I don't really care. 801,000. Fantastic. And yes, I did just sell the domain resurgent blueprints on the black market. So that does mean the pirates might start using domain resurgent stuff soon. 
How cool will that be? Uh, I don't think they always stay as a contact. <laughs> Not from my experience. They Sometimes for me, I buy something off an arms dealer and then they sit there in the like contacts bit, but then I can never use them again. I don't know if that's meant to be like a bug or a glitch or something, but it's happened to be quite a few times and I've been very upset about it. All right, let's go over to Mining World 101. Aha! Hello. Good sir. All right. Now we could just buy a Paragon. We could just, we could just do it. Or we could get, so he's got red guard designs. Oh my God. I can't get over it. This is got this is definitely been the best arms arms dealer I've ever seen. Right. Let's keep it basic. Uh what do we want? It's got lances, plasma mini guns. Uh I don't, I don't even know. You know that thing like spoiled for choice? Uh, <laughs> oh, he's even got the crystals. Uh, tell you what. You can never go wrong with remnant lances. You can't go wrong with gauss cannons. So we'll start off with a couple of those. Uh, analysis paralysis. Yeah, exactly that. Uh, you can never go wrong with those. Right. Heavy burst laser attack lasers. I don't think I really need those. Just remnant weapons. That's pretty much what I was going to stick with, to be fair. I wonder if I can just alternate the design. What a pressure gun. Uh, oh, our great houses stuff is also pretty good. Uh, you could actually buy some Star Federation stuff. You could actually put proper Star Fed guns on my shit. All right. Obviously, buy up 10 of those, get a load of Remnant Tack lasers, Remnant Rail guns. Uh, you know, just, just fucking give, give me everything. Just give me everything. Phase lances. Don't want mining lasers. Ion cannons, give me five of those. Beams, give me give me like ten of those. Little lasers, don't really use them too much, but I'll take some. Couple of those. We've already got loads of those. Give me some long range point defense lasers. Couple of those. Heavy remnant blasters, couple of those. Don't really use the remnant auto cannons. We've got a couple of those. Alright, that's like a bunch of shit there. Um, fighters. What good fighters do you have? Hmm. I feel like for the meme, we should just get like the super heavy bomber. Oh, fuck it. We'll get one. We'll get one super heavy bomber. Uh... Jackhammers. Oh, yeah, the jackhammers. We'll get a couple of those. Why not? Uh... Oh, he does have the... Uh... Trident wings are very good as well. Let's get, let's get a couple of those. Um... More Cobra Wing, though. Um... <laughs> Oh, he's got the chain gun bombers. Give me like five. Give me like six of those. I love those. Oh my God. This man is. This man is amazing. I love this man. Right. What large? Let's sort by large. 
Strength to still need us. Uh, Giga scrap shot. <laughs> He's got like the big old super beams. Uh, to be fair, I think we're pretty much set on everything that we need. We'll grab a couple of Reaper launchers for good luck. Uh... Couple of Hamel barrages for good luck. You can never go wrong with those. Um, to be fair, let's just grab a few random pulse lasers as well. I mean, that that will do, right? I think that will do. Let's just go for that. Cool. Oh, look at that! It did turn into a contact. Fantastic. That actually did work for a change. On my main planet, develop contact, prioritize. Hey, hey. Actually has some work. Construction project. Fuck it. Let's do it. Let's build a pirate base for him. Why not? We have the metal. We have all the resources here. I love, I, I love that guy. He's so cool. Uh, right, what was it, like a thousand metal we needed? Three hundred supplies, one hundred and fifty heavy machinery. Yes, I will. I will do it. If he keeps selling me guns, I will do whatever that man wants. Right, two hundred elite. Or was it three hundred? I think it was three hundred, wasn't it? That was two hundred. I was right. Jesus Christ. All right, cool. With that order in, let's head over there and drop those off. Let's take a save as well. This is a save moment. God damn. You know, what was that film Nicolas Cage was in, which was all about arms dealing? You know, sometimes you need uh, 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 an art. Ooh. Sometimes you need a middleman to sell guns without you looking... I don't know. I don't know what the fuck. Lord of War, that was it. Some quote about needing an arms dealer. An independent runner to sell guns. Yeah, Lord of War is actually a really good film. I think I've seen it like two or three times now. And every time I'm still there like... I like this film. <laughs> To be fair, they can fucking try and stop me. Yeah, exactly. Or... Oh... Uh... Uh... Uh, hey Matthew, thanks for the 41 months. We, uh, we identify you as a pirate and a criminal. All right. But yeah, Matthew, thanks for the uh, yeah, thanks for that forty-one months. By the way, thank you very much. I do appreciate it. Let's go kill some iron shell nerds. For my uh, uh, new gun running companion, I must satisfy that arms dealer in every way possible. Because that man must. We must and will be my friend forever now. I don't care what I have to do. If he wants to sell me guns like that, I am not gonna... I am not gonna break that relationship. I will <laughs> commit all sorts of war crimes for him. No matter the cost to civilian life. Even if it does mean we have to kill some tax, I don't know, people. Tax waifus, would that be the way to describe them? 
Oh, oh god, I forgot these about the I forgot about these these indomitable ships. They are all about ramming. It's all right though. No. Jokes on them. The closer they get to me, the more they're likely they're gonna die. Oh no! I just killed the Buffalo Mark II. No! <laughs> the Buffalo Mark II is down. Right, we need to get this guy off my carriers, please. Hey. This fucking guy just killed two of my carriers. Just killed another one of my carriers. Fucking Christ. Let's fuck these fucking ships. Fuck off. We're a little bit all over the place, boys. Everyone sort of regroup on me. We need to, uh, the, I guess the best way we can uh, counter them by is by not letting them disrupt our line. Shut up now. <laughs> Look, I'm just trying to use accurate terminology, all right? All right. That indomitable down there, that needs to go. That one needs to go. That's got a level 7 commander in it. But also, that enforcer's looking pretty tasty. Uh! Right, everyone. Kill this thing. Kill this thing now. It's ramming me through my special shield. That's not allowed. But I think that just cost him his life. More missiles. Come on. More special missiles. Oh, come on. Cannon, move around faster. There we go. Oh, God. Hang in there, ship. You're a tank. Oh, I'm sending my missiles back at me! You little fuck. How dare you. Alright, no missiles on these ships then, I suppose. Yeah! Who's the boss? You little fuck. All right, let's get on the offensive here, I guess. All right, get get back supporting me. Come on. There we go. He's overloaded. Out comes the missiles. Just burn drive towards them. That's the one thing I do find a little bit weird on the ship is that it's ship special ship mod is that it's a burn drive out of all the high-tech features it has it's simple it's it just has a simple burn drive i thought it would at least have like a plasma jump or something like that but okay oh look at that cobra wing up there in the top left too easy apparently love it stupid stupid iron shell do my ships back oh the Buffalo Mark II is a difficult recovery, so I am not recovering the Mark II. Shout at me all you want, but it's not happening. Oh, wow, I actually got paid quite a bit for that. Um, yeah, I know, but surely it should have, like, the high-tech one. Like, was it, like, plasma burn or plasma jump, whatever, you know what I mean? The one that rapidly jumps forward, like... Pretty much all the other ones have. I would have thought I would have had that. Uh, right. Where have I got to dump this off? But yeah, I know that kind of makes sense for it. But that's that's just 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 my thought, my two, my two cents. Not that it really matters. As a actually, it does matter because I am the uh, big time streamer. Oh, hang on. That, 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 that needs an effect when I say that, I think. Hang on, hang on, hang on. 
It, it should matter because I am the big time streamer. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go dump down this construction stuff. <laughs> Childlike. <laughs> what? You gotta, you, gotta, you gotta add a reverb to things every now and then. Good memes. Oh my god, there's a mortar station there. Um, It will target... Your location is known. Is it actually going to shoot at me or is it just going to pretend to shoot at me? I don't think it's going to shoot at me. <laughs> Sounds like you're fully for a while. Oh my god. Hey, pirates. Yeah, you know me. How you guys doing? Hi. Here's your resources. Please don't kill me. Now we leave. Constructing base. Are they actually like... This sounds dumb, but are we actually going to see them plop down a base? Or is it just going to... Leave them like that? Ah! Cool! We made that! Alright, nice. Well... That's job complete. Like 200,000, I think that was, or something like that. Do I actually do I need to return back or something? I think I got paid. I got paid for that, didn't I? That was like 200,000, right? I don't know. Job done, though. Let's let's head home. Look, like I said, you. Sh you what? They're invading my gas giant? That's just rude. Okay. Let's get home, I guess, and defend my planet. I didn't realize we were at war with the hedge again. I guess that fight with the iron shell must have put us back at war with them. Or maybe having... Uh, <laughs> or maybe building that... Uh, <laughs> maybe building that uh, uh, pirate base has probably put us at war with them. Ah, well... Not my problem. Well, it is actually because they're invading me, but it's not my problem. <laughs> How big is the invasion fleet? It can't be that big, right? Uh, one fairly strong fleet, but that doesn't... They might be sending some special task groups at me, so I should probably get a defensive fleet built. Just in case. We've got the money. We've got a mill in the bank. This is really turning into a pirate. Yeah, we're actually going to be swapping over to a uh, pirate. Um, what? Well, yeah, we're going to be swapping over to the pirates. That's, uh, that's pretty much what's going on here. There's pirate mining operation, not star fed. <laughs> Actually just lining ourselves up for the law of FTL and we're going to be coming to Rebellion soon. That's actually the whole gimmick of this playthrough. Is we will be, we'll, we'll be spray painting all of our ships orange soon. Uh, right. Let's get over here then. Oh. I fly all the way home and then we're no longer hostile with them. Fantastic. Don't you need don't even waste any more money. Let's see if my main man Charles here has got any more work for me. Oh, he's got an old freighter. That was terrible. Oh He wants to sell me more stuff. Oh my fucking god! Oh my god! <laughs> Look at this man! He's got a locomotive for sale! A knife battle group paragon! Oh my fuck! This man literally has everything. What the fuck? <laughs> I I don't know what to say. We could get 
was that a fourth battle group fucking onslaught oh my god tyrant you know fucking 14th battle group tyrants onslaughts i, I don't even know i i don't even know i, I don't know This, 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 this is a man. This really is a beautiful, beautiful man. Um, but he also has Star Federation security codes, apparently. As well. <laughs> sure, why not? <laughs> uh, I don't think I need a better ship, to be fair. Do, do, do I need? I just. I, I, I don't know. I, we could just go all out and just buy the locomotive, right? <laughs> just go ro rock around in a fucking station. No, we, we can't afford any. We can't really afford any of the big stuff. We don't need to change our main ship out anyway. Uh, I've already bought new stuff. I've already bought a load of weapons from him, like fighter wings, so we should be able to. Uh... When's that arriving? I think it's already arrived. Um. Ah, right, yeah, there you go. We've already got him. So we could put a jackhammer down as on my ship. But uh, what I was going to do is I was going to put the super heavy bomber on this. Oh, 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 here we go. Let's see what this bomb is all about. Go get a boy. I paid good money for you. Oh, can we not? Oh, fire. Was that it? Is that all you do? Four little missiles? I paid 50 grand for that! I mean, I suppose it's not terrible because it's quick. It's guided torpedoes, which do 200% damage to armor, which is probably pretty good for me because... I don't actually have much armor dealing weapons. I only have two heavy maulers on the front here because this is a hull buster. And then, yeah, I, you know what? I'll accept it. It's pro probably not bad. You know, it's probably good. Uh, you know, I'll take it. All right. Right. Uh, Take. Give me, give me. There we are. Give me, give me, give me a man after midnight. Uh, here we go. Big ships. Right. Let's take our design we have here, which probably isn't isn't too bad, to be fair. Let's give it an actual proper run. So we've got the heavy pulses here backed up with the ion pulses. So we throw out a lot of EMP. I think we're probably the main... And we also have our guided torpedoes. Uh, yeah, this is just a... Yeah, it's just an all-round alright design, I think. We've just got some point defense lasers everywhere. To be fair, those can probably just go down to normal point defense lasers. They don't need to be long-range ones. Saves us a couple of points here and there. Uh, right, so it's got integrated targeting unit, stabilized shields. Yeah. Okay. Great bonuses, more like... Great ha <laughs> Great houses, more like bad houses. You guys are... You, got, you guys should... Are comedy geniuses. Uh... <laughs> 
the light needle on the four little front mount four light needles i don't think that's gonna happen i think that will just completely i don't think the ship could handle that to be fair i've only got uh two on the front i've got a remnant auto cannon on the front and four fucking pulses do we not have anything else <laughs> uh i suppose we don't That's really not a bad idea, actually. Let's uh, throw on some of those remnant pulse lasers that I have. There we are. That's happy days. And then we can just do the same on that one. All right, cool. Uh, yeah, there's there's nothing really to change on our main ship here. French guy, oh no, uneasy, uneasy. We got we got Frenchies in here. You need to do your thing. <laughs> uh, oh god, this thing. Why? No, no. Give me something that's actually decent. Oh yeah, I gave. My original design had nav relays on it, didn't it? Oh, that's a brilliant idea. Because now... I forgot how good of an idea that is. Right. Bend that off, right. Because now with that, I should have so much speed in all of my... Uh, things. Um... God, it's actually like messed up the carrier design though. Because in theory now, if I actually deploy with all of my carriers, we're coming out with 14% more speed, baby. <laughs> Nothing's going to catch our ships. <laughs> that was what the meme I was going with with those. <laughs> um... But no, what's so also serious? I mean, it literally wants me just to stick salamanders on it. Mod needs more power. <laughs> there we go. Good stuff all around here. Uh, right, let's actually build some sensible things here. We'll, we'll keep one. We'll have one which has a jack camera on it just for meme purposes. And this one can have the assault drones. We'll stick a point defense laser on the back. This one can be the... This one can have some claws and one of the Cobra bombers. Actually, no. We can probably just do one of the Trident bombers on it. Which has the fucking torpedoes that will kill everything. And you've just got some fighters just to keep things ticking over and then everyone else has their own little assault drones whilst i have this super heavy bomber thing so in theory when it comes to the fighter and i guess we'll just call it air superiority fight we should win every single time let's get some more ships being built or at least that's what I'm going for here. Let's get a couple of invaders. We probably don't need any more carriers. I think we have enough carriers at this point. We just need some... We just need some smaller ships, really, to just be... Yeah, we just need some smaller ships, really. So let's get four invaders going. <laughs> yeah but that's probably not a bad idea actually a couple of small brawler looking ships as well uh
There we go. Uh, disappeared for about an hour. Has Ryan improved at all? Yes. I have a really overpowered arms dealer. So, uh, it's all happy days over here. Look at this man. Look at anything I want to buy. This man has it. So, we're, it's all happy days. All happy days for us. Um. Oh yeah, we also have a battle station here now. So no one is going to be invading our planet anymore. It's getting upgraded to a goddamn star fortress, so... They can fucking try it. Uh, let's get some fuel production going here. Start producing our own fuel. Uh, production world. Uh, more fuel, I think. Fuck it, let's produce more fuel in the Sindrian. Aha! Or we, or we could just go for a supercomputer. <laughs> um, should we do a supercomputer? So if I actually, if I remember correctly, a supercomputer on our main planet would be is a really good idea. Fuck it, we're building a supercomputer. Hell yeah! And then with my Star Fortress, they can only try and stop me. Are you winning? Yes, I think so. We are winning through sheer perseverance. Yeah? Uh, uh, yeah? G guys? <laughs> uh, uh, yeah? No? No? Fuck. Come on. <laughs> it was okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear not great not bad. Uh, you never found them the awful multi-part pirate ships i can't remember what they're exactly called hang on uh oh fuck what are they called uh, I have so many mods, so I think they're... Let me just see if I can just... I can't remember what they are called, but... Let's see if I can just find one by just clicking through. Pro strat here. Pretty sure it's their class as destroyers. Uh... Uh, nah, I don't think I'm going to find it. I don't think this is too ambitious. I think we're on all ships anyway, yeah. Nah, I don't think I'm going to find it for you. I thought maybe we could get a lucky find with that stream of luck, but... Uh... Ah, oh, fuck it. Maybe I can... Maybe Actually, hang on a minute. There might be another way. <laughs> Let's see if our boy here has one. <laughs> oh my god, yeah, he's got all the... He's got everything. Uh, no. HMI modification? No. Hack job? No. Well, it's definitely not going to be in high tech. Junkers? No. Yeah, I don't know if it's under. I don't think it's in. Oh my god, what is that? Uh, I don't think he's got one. This is all low-tech. Merchant Marine. 
Oh my god, I've never actually seen those ships. <laughs> Research ships? Drive at AI. What the hell are these from? I've never seen these. AI dooms? What the fuck? I've never seen research mandate ships. Okay. Uh. Always star fed, car, starlight. Uh, and yeah, no. Yeah. Yeah, super, the crappy uh, HMI ships, which you can build stuff on. I do have witch mod, I think. Yeah. So, I don't know. Yeah, Star Federation. It's on the witch mod. Uh, I've never actually used them myself. I've seen them a lot. I've seen them a lot, but I've never actually used them myself. I think we had a blueprint for them. That's where we started talking about them last stream. We had a blueprint to build them and I didn't take it because I thought it would be a stupid idea. But yeah. But we, I, you, you'll find them eventually. You just keep looking, my friend. <laughs> I don't think you want to find them though. They're fucking terrible. <laughs> it's the sort of thing you'll probably find on like a pirate planet. Uh, but yeah, let's speed up time for a second because I want to get this supercomputer built, which is only going to take 30 days. So let's just do the age old question, shall we? How's everybody doing today? <laughs> let's do some of that streamer chat interaction. Fuck off. <laughs> I don't think so. It's my birthday. Well, happy birthday. And uh, uh, I'm glad you've decided to spend it here. Better than you, Fat I made a grilled cheese. Ooh. Mm. My left nut is better entertaining. Well, I don't you suffer from like testis testicular torsion or whatever it's called? Testis. Testicular torsion. I can't say it. Yeah. Isn't that isn't that so are you saying that your balls twisting is more entertaining than me? Because that would be very rude. <laughs> How fucking rageous. Hey, what's up, Q Pog? How you doing? Ross sec the time. I'm not celebrating today, yeah, it's just chill with a ton of Yeah, fair enough. Yeah, it's very rare I actually, like, celebrate my birthday on my birthday. It's usually have to wait, because I don't think my birthday ever really falls on a weekend, so I always have to wait till the weekend. I usually go paintballing. Every year we used to go paintballing, but I don't do it anymore because it's so fucking expensive. <laughs> Into this game, even have it on PC, but I've never really gotten around to playing yeah it's it's worth it it's it's super fun it's one of those games where you start playing and then suddenly uh three hours have disappeared although i've started playing football manager again and i've noticed that in my life that's another one of those games where you sort of go i'll play for another 10 minutes and then suddenly it's been two hours the world cup has got me back into football so you know i got I'm, be joining a be joining a five aside team soon as well. I was actually called up to play yesterday, and I was like, actually, I can't because I haven't actually bought. <laughs> I haven't even got a pair of football boots yet. <laughs> nah, it's just uh, it's it's all. So where I used to work, uh, we've all left now. Like all like the original quote-unquote ogs of the company uh we, we've all left and we've started a uh, five-a-side team of ex-retail workers so 
it's it's going to be interesting although apparently last week they were meant to play and uh we we're meant to go in with like eight people and they could only get four people <laughs> <laughs> all right supercomputer is installed um we can throw in our uh a, a, a super computer uh i suppose we probably want to throw in an ai core on this that's uh i don't really want to put an alpha in it to be fair i don't really is it worth throwing an alpha ai core in it or is it worth just putting a beta core in it Mm. All right, catch you later, man. Thanks for stopping by. I do appreciate it. Uh, what would you stop you cost? It will last three months before burning out. Ah, uh, yes. I forgot that things burn out. Ah, uh, generate extra income each month. Let's let's throw a beta in it. Fuck it. It'll give us extra money. Three hundred twenty thousand. We're gonna make. Uh, and then our. Star Federation Star Fortress thing will be ready in a few days. We'll watch that build up. Go on. Do it. Do it. Transform into bigger station, please. Come on. Come on. <laughs> There we go. Bigger station. They can try and raid me now. Try and raid my supercomputer. I'll never get through. Oh my god. This planet now makes 434,000. Shit me. Uh, what makes the money? It's the refining that makes the money. So if I... I think it might be worth spending the points and upgrading the refinery. Actually, nah, not for eight story points. I don't think that's quite worth it. Uh oh shit, yeah, I have that thing for uh I still have some AI calls to throw around. There we go. Uh then I've got a few things to throw down. Let's go. You, you, then we, ah, oh yeah, we need to build a centralization bro as well. That's what we need to build. Next page, centralization bro. We're we'll getting, we're really ramping up the uh, AI. We're, we're going to have Ludic Path bombing us soon. Ludic Path enhancement sounds cool until you get ID'd. That reminds me. That reminds me of something. Hang on a minute. <laughs> oh yeah let's get that bought shall we uh right install item okay we can't put that there but what we can do is install this increase the uh, sizes of the fleets launched. Fantastic. Pirates, really? You're damn right you're gonna leave. Get out of here. You really? They really are trying to take that station out, aren't they? Alright. That's them dead. <laughs> oh oh you're gonna hate this one all right just chuck that shit on this planet right install item not a gas giant well fuck you then <laughs> oh 402,000 supercomputer generated another 12,000 as well ladies and gentlemen we're officially in the money. Uh, but it does mean we're going to have to go and grab some more AI cores soon. We'll just wait for this. Wait for the bureau to be built. 
uh, centralization bro to be built and then we'll go and head down to the mess i think and uh fight them for a little bit also ieds are properly deployed made the game super easy yeah i mean i killed the dragon reborn with ieds so i don't know about you guys but i feel like that <laughs> alone <laughs> proves that ieds are fantastic Banner and binder, fuck you, Ron. Well, that's just. That's just rude. I think you should apologize for that one, sir. Uh, I mean, it's literally. Uh, I think uh, they literally called the Starlight. Cabal. Hang on a minute. Just checking to see how the new video is doing, performance-wise. It's doing alright. I think it's just crossed 20k views. Which is nice. Happy days. I hope you all enjoyed it. Because that, that's the last one for the year. <laughs> Fuck you, you little shit. Oh, okay. Yeah, to be fair, artillery ships pretty much counter. And anything with range just counters IEDs. To be fair, you just sort of shoot them and then they die. Very, uh, very easy way to deal with them. Or you just spam them with fighters. There's a lot of ways to counter them. It's just when you get, it's just when the AI manages to pull a sneaky on you and you get, and it sneaks an IED all the way around the back into your carriers is when it's fucking annoying. Or phase ships, you get them to. Uh, target a phase ship and then you just phase out of reality and then they just explode. There's loads of ways to count on them. Right. This is just a waiting game for the moment. I just want to get this uh, bro set up in a sheet before we head out again. Wait, 440,000 plus another 40 grand from this computer. Holy dog shit. And 20 days to our custom orders done as well. That's kind of what I'm waiting for as well. Mm. Oh, come on, come on. Fourteen days. Hmm. Don't you worry. Don't you worry your little bones. I've got a surprise coming out. Or do I do that really annoying thing where I leave it till next stream just to keep you guys all on a cliffhanger? Wouldn't that be fun? <laughs> Nah, too far. I, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna go. Uh, no, definitely not. I'm gonna go. Well, okay. Centralized bureau is done. Cool. Right, we don't need to throw like a camera in there. We don't need to throw anything like major in it. Uh, install item. We'll put that in there, and then we'll just. Oh. Wait. We, we not put any AI in it? Well, there's a logistics core, I guess. Count. I don't know. There you go. That pushes us up to 484,000 on this planet. And it should boost the income of all the other planets, but it kind of has, I guess. Cool. Right. Production of three days. Well, no, it's absolutely not. Christmas special. I don't know. 
Doesn't sound like me. All right, custom blueprint is down. Hell yeah. <laughs> Here we go. Bombardment of the Divine Wrath, eh? Incapable of efficiency overhaul. Really? Fighting with light alarm reduces combat readiness by 30%. Uh, I am very, very good. Hey, ever seen an IED shoot an IED? Yeet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's fucking beautiful. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, it's magical. Christmas has come early. Although I think you do only get one shot of it, unfortunately. But that's that's beautiful. Uh, too fair. I wonder if something stupid like expanded missile racks gives it like an extra shot. Uh <laughs> oh, it only does. <laughs> I thought that was a joke. Oh, <laughs> oh shit. Oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it doesn't. Oh, what a shame. Oh, what a beautiful ship. <laughs> All right. Okay. Yeah. So that that that's a, that's a good ship. It's good. And so yeah, basically, it's just a big old bomb. <laughs> yeah. Yes, it does. Um, but we're going to put that away. We're going to put that away because that is a dangerous weapon. That is, that is a very, very dangerous weapon. And we will tread lightly when using it. We will only use it, uh, when, when I deem it necessary <laughs> under extreme circumstances. Like if the, the hedge come and invade us again, let's take a quick save. Oh dear. Anyway, let's go kill some mess because we're going to need some more blueprint. Not blueprints. We need some more AI cores, and a very really good place to get them is killing the shitters down south. Or we could try and kill some uh, super high tech pirates. Well, they're AI calls, but we're not actually at war with them yet, so that's fine. We're having fun. I have been having a few whiskeys here after work. I'm very relaxed now. Uh, do you know? Yes, I. Well, I don't know them personally, but I know of them. I haven't watched a Soviet Womble video in like yonks though. Oh, but yeah, I haven't I haven't done either of those things. I haven't drunk. I haven't watched a Soviet Womble video. <laughs> Jesus. Uh Fire in a task. <laughs> okay. Let's go top ourselves up. Because we're gonna need a lot of AI cores, I think. We're going to need a large amount of them if we're going to continue running this supercomputer. Well, hi from the ZF guys. Come join us for some game, group games. You know what? I might just do that one day. I do appreciate it. I do appreciate the invitation, so I might take you up on it one day. Come join all of you and show how it's all done on armor. Like a real man. Uh... <laughs> 
talking to a man who was 200 hours in hell let loose, so... Uh, I don't want to be that guy, but I know what the face of war is. <laughs> Alright, let's go kill some mess nerds. You know what? I might just do that. Oh, shit me, man. Straight into a mess swarm, though. Fucking hell. Uh, <laughs> I wasn't used to big time people who have manners. I'm not used to anyone who has manners in this chat, to be honest. Look, does this technically count as being, like, headhunted? <laughs> uh, <laughs> all right let's uh this should um this should be reasonably easy right considering how overpowered this ship is we should be able to just hang on let's do the old meme shall we let's just set it to autopilot and let's just sit back and watch the world burn uh. Did I, uh, ever tell you how easy this game is? <laughs> you know? <laughs> Sometimes it's, uh, it, it's, it's far too, far too easy, you know what I mean? All right, let's uh, <laughs> let's actually do something now. I will I will not just sit here on autopilot. I'm not that much of a, a piece of shit. Um, <laughs> what do you mean? Yes, I am. I like to think they're not even going to be able to break through my shit, like. I don't think they're going to be able to break through my shield. Ugh. We don't... Uh, right. Why are you surprised? What do you mean, why am I surprised? I'm not surprised that uneasy throwing abuse at me. Didn't know you actually recruited for at some point you were for. <laughs> what are you trying to say? Like Z the ZF clan are just a bunch of cultists that <laughs> abducts you. <laughs> Once you join, you can never leave. You are forever locked in the basement and forced to play armor. Um... <laughs> I'm sure you guys do a lot more than armor free, but that's what I suppose a lot of it's known for, I think. Uh, all right, let's let the ships repair a little bit. Actually, too bad, there's a station here. Let's go jump on that quickly. <laughs> if they're in a cult, they don't bully each other. Hmm. If that's the case, I need to uh, I need to set up a cult immediately. Uh, <laughs> maybe my own people, maybe my own people won't bully me. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> just because I can't speak English doesn't mean you have to bully me for it. God. All right, let's kill some let's kill some more of these guys. As you can see, there we uh, got a f quite a few um quite a few cores there. Dream on, buddy. <laughs> we. To be fair, if there's one thing to come out with this ship, it's got a hell of a lot of maneuverability. I think that's what makes this ship so good. It's got. It just maneuvers so well. 
It's so elegant. And I think that's the one thing we can take away from this. Is that perseverance is what you need. In <laughs> uh, we ripped the shit out of each other. And there's a holder in the group. In the north. Hmm. I feel like I have years of experience then. Of being ripped the shit out of. Wait, how long have I known you on easy? Every day of my life, you've just thrown abuse at me? <laughs> I'm, a, I'm a hardened veteran of cyberbullying. <laughs> Two years. Look, all right. I will not have that. I am not a Tory. I don't know what you're talking about, all right? Just because I have a, an investment ISA, a mortgage, <laughs> you know, does not make me a Tory. <laughs> Yeah, sure, man. Uh, I, uh, yeah, just uh, drop me an, uh, just drop me an invitation on Discord. I think I've got it set so people can't message me for like you know, so they don't fucking spam me with shit. But yeah, just send me an invite on Discord. I'm, I'm sure I'll be around Friday. If not, I'll be down for any other time. Hey, this mess killing is fucking easy. Fucking Tory. What? I'm not a card carrying Tory. I know a card carrying Tory, but I'm not a card carrying Tory. <laughs> I will not have this slander just promoting violence against me. <laughs> How fucking outrageous. All right. I think all the mess are retreating. This is the one thing that I don't like fighting a mess is they retreat and then it doesn't actually end the battle. They have to retreat first, but minor dig. I think there's still one dominator alive down there. Get fucking wrecked. All right, give me some more cores. There we are. Five gamma cores, another beta core. I'm telling you, right, this is the place to be. I have never given bad advice in this game. Or I don't think I have. And this is another one of Ra's pro advice life tips. You need cores, you come down to the mess. Give lots of bad. When, when have I ever given bad advice? Come on, hit me with some bad advice that I've ever given in Star Sector. Like, I know life, I give a lot of shit advice, but in in, in Star Sector, like lasers are good. All right, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm gonna break your heart, but there is nothing more satisfying. I'll fucking say it uneasy. I'll say it. Don't make me say it. There's nothing more satisfying. Oh, shit. Uh, okay. There's nothing more satisfying than having a bunch of lasers and EMP and ion beams and fucking destroying someone's fucking dreams and watching a low-tech ship float around with its engines disabled and all of its guns disabled with, because of your big old lasers. There you go. Said it. All right. Raw class is bad. The Infump. Okay. Don't diss the Infumper. The Infumper was quality ship design. Hey, do you reckon we should try and colonize this? Remember I was talking about this the other day? Do you reckon we should just colonize this planet with 1,250% hazard rating? <laughs> Fucking do it. Let's do it. Let's take a save. Let's see if it breaks the game. Colonize. Nice. 
Ha-ha! Oh my god! Minus 81% growth! Oh, that's disgusting! Hazard pay. <laughs> Let's fucking do it. Uh... <laughs> Oh my god. I need some crew first. Give me more crew. I was wondering what the law is behind this and why is it so hazardous? Because it's filled with like the mess, if I remember correctly, and uh anything the mess touches it turns into grey bubbles. Or something like that. It just turns into goo. I don't think this planet is ever going to be... Uh... Well, we'll see. Let's get the star... Uh... Let's just get the star... <laughs> fucking thingy built. We'll see what happens. Sell the planet to the HMI. Unless it allows you to mine AI. I don't think it allows you to do... I think the whole idea is this planet is fucked. But it even says a truly horrific and terrible place. I don't think it's it's really got nothing going for it. <laughs> Sell it to your enemies. <laughs> yeah, catch you later, man. Take care of yourself. And I look forward to hearing from you. Um. In the meantime, let's see what happens. Uh, <laughs> sounds like London. <laughs> hmm. All right, let's have a look. Okay, it's still one more day. One more day. Yeah, I, I'll agree with you on that. London is a fucking shithole. I absolutely hate London. I think I talk about this like every stream, like how much I hate London, but yeah, I, I don't like London. All right. 1% growth. We could do it. <laughs> we could actually fund, we could actually grow this planet. It's going to cost us 274000 a month. But we could do it. We could do it. Oh, yeah. We also have zero stability. We also have a minus 10 from mess infestation as well. Minus 100% accessibility. Literally, it, it just... It's not good. So the mess infestation gives it a thousand hazard rating. Minus 230 growth. Minus 100% hazard. Uh, minus 100% accessibility. And minus 10 stability. Yeah. I think I think this is a sell job. Uh, right. Open cart. I can't remember even how you sell a planet. Yeah, transfer to another market. <laughs> Should we give it to the Lodic Path? <laughs> <laughs> I, th I think we should set it to the Lodic Path. I, th I, th I think that's the faction we, sh we should go with. Or we sell it to the Hedge. And then, actually, no, I think... Hmm. Or the Ninth Battle Group. <laughs> nah, we'll just sell it to the Hedge. We'll just sell it to the HMI. What do we sell? Oh, I don't know. Govern in the name of the Star Federation? Nah, fuck that. Yeah, let's just say it to, let's just say it to the HMI. Let's play it safe. There you go. They're going to give me one relation. One positive relation. Let's, let's see what the AI does with it. <laughs> They're building they're actually developing the planet why why are they developing it why did they not just abandon it straight away <laughs> nice nice <laughs> uh 
are just there like, God damn, this is the <laughs> Finally, some good fucking... <laughs> some good fucking planet. <laughs> oh, dear. Right. Ladies and gentlemen, on that note, though, I think it's a good time to end. So, uh... What the fuck are you searching me for? I just sold you a planet. Do you not appreciate what I've done for you? I gave you a whole planet. Ugh. But yeah, everybody. As always, I do massively appreciate you stopping by and watching this shenanigans.